What's going on, fellas? What's going on? I think my chair is too low. What the fuck? Lil TA was in it. What's going on, everybody? Welcome, welcome, welcome. You can't spell Titans without putting that TA in it. How's everybody doing today? Today. God damn, we've been busy as fuck, bro. It's been crazy. I'm, I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be honest. It's been crazy. Charlotte, um, I think Charlotte was asking about the memberships. Uh, for all the people wondering, it's uh, the memberships are gonna be pinned at the top. Um, so it's easy to find. Nobody will have any issues with that. So. Yes, sir. Oh, man, what a long-ass day, fellas. What a long-ass day. Um, we're going to let everyone take their seats right when we get to about the about the Will Levis mark. We'll start, get, we'll start getting going. We're going to say hi to everybody, say what's up, and get going. <coughs> Fun stuff. True facelift coming, you guys. True facelift coming. Uh, new mods. We're going to get brand new mods. Um, brand new badges, brand new everything, you guys. We've been so busy lately; it's been crazy. Um, yeah, it's it's wild when um uh, when when your thing gets taken for for a few months, it's it's pretty wild. And then when you get it back, the amount of uh, adjustments you have to do, so to say, is pretty wild. It's pretty wild. So, uh, let's say what's up to everybody first. Let's say what's up to every. Let me. What the fuck is going on with it? There we go. All right, I'm gonna say what's up. Uh, let's see, uh, Lou, man, what's up, bro? Uh, a lot of people are upset with Will, uh, not Will, Malik Willis. He's not good, though. Everybody knows that. Everybody knows that. Titan South, Over Chicken, Titans Fam. Jonathan, what's up, man? I know, I was gonna say, I haven't seen you in a minute, bro. <laughs> I haven't seen you in a minute. I was like, hopefully he's okay, man. It's crazy, if you guys think about it, um... You know, the Jaguars haven't really been doing much. The um, the Colts just bringing back the same people. And uh, you got the Titans and the Texans just trading, trading jabs, if you will. It's crazy. Um, you know, both of these teams, both of these teams have so much talent and, and enough to do so much work, so much damage. Um, you look at uh, you look at some of the teams like uh Look at our team this year, and, and it's crazy because we still have the draft. You know, we 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 still have the draft, and and both teams are just going to get better. But um, you know, we have Will Levis. They've got C.J. Stroud uh, for running back. They uh, we've got Tony Pollard and Ty J. Spears. They've got Joe Mixon and Damian Pierce. Um, I don't know what the fuck that's doing. Uh, for wide receiver, we have DeAndre Hopkins, Calvin Ridley, and Traylon Burks. And they have uh, Stephon Diggs, Tank Dell, and Nico Collins. They have Dalton Schultz to our Chigazime Okonkwo, also known as Chiggy. And um, again, uh, I think our offensive line, as of right now, is not not on their offensive line's level yet. But we're gonna get there, so I'm not I'm not too I'm not too worried about that. Um, but I mean, it's crazy. These are high powered offenses, super high powered offenses, and I, I honestly can't wait to see, you know, what we do um you know going into week one and and how it looks because this team's gonna this titans team's gonna be able to gonna be able to put in some work i really i really truly i, I really truly feel like this titans team is gonna surprise a lot of people billy scott what's up bro holy shit man it's been a long day today bro long day today it feels good to be live with with all my teutonians man how are we feeling out there tonight you guys how are we feeling tonight that's what i'm talking about it just feels good man let me put this up just a little bit All right, that's fine. We'll just leave it like that. Oh, man. What's up? T.A. is the... <laughs> that's crazy. He really changed his name to T.A. is the best. Uh, Titans fan says, T.A., do you think the Titans have a chance at drafting neighbors at seven? Hey, bro. I, I, you never know with the draft. Like I said, um, people trade up all the time. People trade back all the time. People take risks. T people reach. People uh, slot. It's crazy. Like... It's just hard to determine, honestly. It really is. You just gotta just take it one one pick at a time. See if anybody trades up. Um, Cause I'll tell you what, I don't, I don't think the Titans are trading up. I don't think there's any possible way that that happens. Um, but trading back is a real possibility. I really, I really feel like 
if Marvin Harrison Jr. or Malik Neighbors or even Joe Alt isn't there, then don't even take you, you have the seventh pick and a bunch of people that want to jump up and take a receiver or a, or a quarterback. Sorry. So that's a perfect opportunity to get to win a trade from from that uh, situation. Oh, man, that's crazy. Uh, Titans fan. I appreciate you, bro. Thank you. I, I really appreciate that. Jonathan says, what's up, TA? What's up, bro? What's up? Good to see you, man. Jonathan, like I said, man, you missed a few streams, bro. It's good to see you, man. It's good to see you. <laughs> Charlotte says, I, I want to be a member, but I don't have a Cash App or PayPal. Well, we have a the thing. The link is pinned in the in the, in the top of the chat. Uh, do with that as you may. AFO, Trey Mac, what's good? What's good? What's up, Billy Scott? Sergio, Lou Man. Damn, we got a bunch of people in the building. I appreciate everybody for showing up, everybody supporting the channel. I appreciate you guys, man. It's been crazy, bro. Like, uh, you know, looking at, um, you know, last month, how much this channel has grown. And then uh, going into this month, like, we're already catching up to, like, the watch time is, is, is very impressive, you guys. Like, uh, the amount of people tuning in and staying and everything like that is, is impressive. Same with the impressions and everything like that. So, um, you know, we're continuing to evolve and upgrade and get better. But, um, you know, these these live streams are are amazing, man. We, we're starting to see consistent rooms of, you know, a lot of people. And it's it's crazy, man. Seeing all the new regulars. We've got people that are showing up now from other teams. Like, they, you know what I mean? And that's dope, man. That's what this is about. So, again, it's um, it's crazy. It's crazy how, uh, how a, a sport can bring so many people together for the good and the bad. Um, it's, it's just wild. Sometimes I think about it like that's just crazy sometimes. It's, it's cool, though. It's cool. Nothing like football, right, you guys? Hey, you guys know how we always start off our shows. Put your name, or not your name, sorry. Put your team name in the chat, in caps. Let's find out who you repping. Who you guys repping? I'll put mine first. You guys already know. It's pretty easy. It's pretty cut and paste, fellas. Titans, let's do this. I love it, man. I love it, man. <laughs> How we doing, fellas? Uh, Lou Man says you have good chemistry with your fans, Titans. Hey, bro, it's um, it's the main thing that I like to do. I don't, I mean, I like to be live. That's what I like to do the most. Um, I've got a, uh, I've got some other videos that I'm gonna that I'm gonna drop uh, after this this is over uh, that you guys are gonna like as well. So we're gonna continue to do it, man. We're gonna continue to to uh, push the limit as much as we can. And uh, try to give everybody a fun place to come and, and have a good time and speak their mind. Not worried about, not don't get worried about, you know, not, not being able to say anything or anything like that is, is important to me. But re be respectful at the same time. Uh, Charlotte says, Titans versus Baltimore in the playoffs and Titans shutting down the purple, purple birds, purple pigeons and wins. That'd be dope, Charlotte. That'd be dope. Um, again, Lou, man, thank you for the what you said right there. I appreciate that. Okay, let's find out who everyone's squad is. Hyde is a Titans fan. Hoosier, Jaguars. That's sad. Tyler says Chiefs. Cat Nelson, Titans. Hoosier, Hoosier, you ain't got a... Hoosier, what, what, are you, what are you doing, bro? How are you a Jaguar and a Texans fan? Why do you always come here doing that silly shit, dude? Like, come on, man. Oh, my God. Dale says Titans. Titans fan, Titans. Titans fan, if you said anything but Titans after your name's Titans fan, I'd have been, I'd have been second guessing. Uh, Michael M. Titans. Billy Scott. Appreciate it. Five dollar dono. Tighten up. You know the logo. <laughs> oh, man. Who's your man says, imagine getting kicked out of Dallas and going to California. End up popping up and losing this. What the hell? Dude, this guy's a weirdo, bro. Billy Scott, put him, put him on his first time out. You already know he's going to get like 40 of them. We don't need his his craziness right now. It's wild. Um, what do you guys think? Uh, all, all my Titans fans, all my football fans, I, and it, it, it would be nice to especially know from the people who aren't Titans and Texans fans, but if you are a Titans and Texans fan, let me know Let me know what you think about this crazy-ass uh, new battle. It's going to be offense versus offense. Again, the defense will be able to, you know, do whatever they can do. If the def Hopefully our defense is super good. Hopefully your defense shits the bed no diaper. <laughs> but but again, at the end of the day, um, these these offenses are insane, like like for real insane. Um, having the guys that you have going out and getting getting Stephon Diggs, like like is he still at that level? I don't know, but I I know for a fact he's still good. He's still good. Um, so 
we'll see, bro. I'm just excited that that the Titans went out there and took shit serious. Again, Will Levis at quarterback. We got Tony Pollard and Ty J. Spears taking turns at running back. Uh, DeAndre Hopkins is back. Calvin Ridley, we took the Jaguars' best player. Traylon Burks, we'll see. I mean, trade maybe? Are, are we going to keep him? He's going to be third or fourth? We'll see what we're going to do with him. Uh, Chiggy... Hopefully he hopefully he's been he's been um, he's been <laughs> working on his hands a little bit. Uh, so I'm excited. Uh, you know Brian Callahan, new offensive system. But then over there again, C.J. Stroud. Uh, you know they bring in Joe Mixon from the fucking Bengals. Damian Pierce is you know a solid, reliable back as well. Stephon Diggs comes over to be their new number one. Tank Dell's over there. Nico Collins is is no scrub. Dalton Schultz. Everybody knows he's good. Uh, again, so that's gonna be it's gonna be a battle, bro. It's gonna be a battle. It's gonna be a battle. We haven't even gone to the. We haven't gotten to the draft, bro. That's why this is crazy. This is legitimate crazy. Like, like people, the mainstream media is already, already crowning the Texans. Already saying the Texans got a great offense, and that's fine. You can do that. But why is it the Titans aren't getting enough credit for what they've done in this off season? Giving us a C plus grade in the off season? How does that make sense? We go out and get Legereus Sneed. The Colts thought they were already going to get him when we snag him from them. And just because he goes to the tight... If the Colts would have got him, A+. plus. But because we got him, it, it... What? Calvin Ridley overpaid. How's that... What does that even mean? What does that even mean when everybody else was offering the same the same amount, if not more? Like, this crazy to me. What? It's cr it, it doesn't make any sense. That's what I'm saying. Go, we got Cheeto. We go out and get some of these guys and everything's either overpaid or it's not the right fit or this, this, and that. It's like, who's made, who, who, who made you God and made you be able to predict the fucking future? You're crazy. Just watch us work, bro. Look at everything that we're building. Good luck throwing the ball. Your, your little offense. Our secondary is fire. I know you guys got a solid secondary too, Texans. I, I, again, I'm expecting to go to war. I want to go to war. I want these games to be head-to-head -head war, battle-to-battle. -battle. Best team wins. That's what I want to see, baby. That's what everybody wants to see. But since we got Derrick Henry, man, Derrick Henry turned you guys into just a typical farm animal. The little, the, you know, the little ribeye. You know what I'm saying? Like, y'all weren't doing nothing. He, he, he turned you guys into nothing. But now you're back. Now you're back. Let's go. Let's see how this goes. I can't wait, bro. Derrick Henry's gone. This is the. F this is where the war begins. First season with all of these quarterbacks knowing their starters, going into Week One as the man. And, and, and this is just this is this goes beyond just us and Texans. Anthony Richardson, don't think we forgot about you. <laughs> like, come on, bro. Are you going to be a running back or a quarterback? Learn how to slide. Go to the parks in Indiana, Indianapolis. God damn, say that 30 times. And go down the slides, bro. You're not going to run everybody over. Harold Landry already dragged you down. Like deep blue sea. Like, don't do that. Don't do that. So you better stand there and learn how to throw from the pocket or it's not going to work. Jacksonville. Pretty boy. Beach boy. Trevor Lawrence, is he even ready to play football? <laughs> they started out so good. The AFC version of, 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 of the fucking uh, the Eagles, but not as good, right? Great start. But it's not how you start. It's how you finish. And how did they finish? They finished losing and missing out on the playoffs because of one team, the Tennessee Titans. <laughs> Come on, bro. The Tennessee Titans continue to ruin the Jacksonville Jaguars, the Jacksonville Jungle Kitty Cats' lives, and I love it. So I'm expecting, I'm expecting all these quarterbacks to show up. Everybody's got weapons. There's no more excuses. There's no more excuses. Not like, oh, this team's rebuilding, this team's doing that. We all have enough to compete now. Jaguars, what happened to running over everybody and, and, and taking the AFC South like, like, and, and claiming it as yours now? Texans jumped right in front of you and said, no, it's not your turn yet, little cat. That's hilarious to me. That's hilarious to me. But don't think we went too far behind. The Titans, yeah, we might we might have chipped our sword or, you know what I'm saying? But we went out, got a new motherfucker, and we're ready to play some football. The Tennessee Titans are ready to compete. The Tennessee Titans. A lot of people don't realize what we've done, who we've brought in, and how it's going to affect this next team going forward. You're going to see. This team ain't nothing to play with. 
You're not going to even be able to throw the ball. Jeffrey Simmons is going to be bringing that heat. <laughs> I can't wait, bro. Oh, man. Let's get a $2 donation from Titan South. Appreciate you, bro. He says three weeks until the big day. Tighten up, TA. I'm so happy, bro. I really am. I, I, I just can't wait. I can't wait to see who's going to who's gonna be on this team. Who's going to be on all their teams? Everybody's team. Let's figure it out so we can plug in these final holes and, and, and go to war. You know what I'm saying? Hey, if you guys are new to the channel, hit that like button, comment, subscribe, continue to subscribe, show that support, man. Again, we have Cash App, Money Sign, Titan Anderson for the people who want to check that shit out. Um, but yeah, man, our live streams have been continuing to do well. We're going to be live for two hours again, fellas. Uh, so it's been daily two-hour live streams. Uh, just having fun talking football, you guys. Mostly Titans, of course. Uh, let's see, Dale, Titans, Titans, everybody, damn, there's a lot of Titans fans in here, I appreciate you guys, man, I appreciate you guys, uh, Tyler says, Texans offense clears from a Chiefs fan, okay, and it, again, it's, whatever, that's fine, it's cool, whatever you say, Jonathan says, Diggs, uh, hasn't caught a touchdown in the playoffs since 2021, and last season, uh, there was a stretch of seven games without him having a touchdown as well, Oh, Jonathan's bringing the fire. And remember, Legereus Sneed has completely shut down Stephon Diggs, completely shut him down. Like, he doesn't even know how to play football anymore. He thinks he's playing hockey respectfully. Like, that's crazy to me, bro. It's crazy. Tyler says, Tyler Maxwell says, Texans have three number one receivers and an offensive rookie of the year quarterback. Tyler doesn't know football. They're, th those aren't three number one receivers. That's crazy to me. That's crazy to me. Michael says, tighten up, Lockridge. Lou Min says, uh, we should be able to score some points again. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Yes, sir. Drink your blue monsters. Drink your blue monsters. God, that shit's fire, bro. If you guys haven't had a blue monster, you fucking missing out. Sergio says, I want the Titans to draft one of the top three uh, wide receivers, but we need Joe Alt more. Do we, though? I think, I think it's getting to the point now where it's going to be one of those three guys Maybe even just a, one of those two receivers or trade back. There's so many quarterbacks that are wanted in this draft, and there's a lot of there's a lot of teams back there that want to move up. The Titans could hold a lot of. I mean, if you can get two first rounders this year and some change, you telling me you wouldn't really do that? Come on, bro. We got to have some faith in Rand Carthon. It's not like we need a quarterback. We've already got our quarterback. Um, Mealine says, "What is the Titans' most needs?" It's not. It's not really about what's the most needs. It's. It's. It's because obviously we need receivers. We need offensive linemen. Like we need, we need a lot of things still. But but hear me out. It's um with 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 receivers. There's there's only so many receivers who can score from anywhere on the field. There's receivers who are good, but they may be slow. Uh, or 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 whatever the case may be. There's not a lot of receivers who can do a little bit of everything. D Hop a little bit of everything. Uh, Calvin Ridley a little bit of everything. Traylon Burks. We don't know yet. He, he, he shows signs, but he's always hurt, so that sucks, right? Um, if you have an opportunity to get a Marvin Harrison Jr. or a Malik Neighbors who can do a little bit of everything, those guys you can't pass, bro. You just can't pass upon them. Like, that's crazy. That's, that doesn't make any sense to me. Uh, and because of Brian Callahan's dad, Billy, uh, over there at, uh, being the offensive line coach, I think we could get away with a trade back and getting an offensive lineman. We, uh, we could, or, or even if we take one of those receivers, if they're there at seven— and we're picking at 38, I, I can almost guarantee you we can find somebody at left tackle to hold that hold strong for, for Billy at, uh, uh, at you know, for the Titans offensive line on the left side. Just think about that type of weaponry. You, you get what I'm saying? Like, you cannot pass on that type of explosion. Having that many weapons would be crazy. Just crazy. So that's what that's kind of how I look at it. But again, we do need blocking. It's a fact. We need a few things. <laughs> oh, man, I love it. G1 says, I trust I trust the Titans. Tighten up. Yes, sir. Uh, let's see. Richard Johnson says, Diggs is a drama queen and Sneed owned him. Additionally, he is an aging receiver. Facts. And he's not as, he's not as, uh, I don't know. Maybe he's not as, as good as, as D-Hop while D-Hop is aging. Because D-Hop, to me, is better than him anyway. Like, if, even in their primes, I'm taking D-Hop. I'm sorry. Like, Diggs is, was a beast. But D-Hop, to me, is, is like, if D-Hop had breakaway speed and he's not the slowest but he's not known for breakaway speed if he had true burner speed fucking a bro my god but he has everything else he has the clock radius the 
do, 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 him and Ridley together. Wait until we start doing the Madden games online. It's going to be me up here and, the, and Madden under here. And we're going to be talking a lot of shit. It's going to be so much fun. I can't wait for the new Madden game. I can't wait, bro. You guys let me know in the comment section below. Who do you guys want the Tennessee Titans to draft at seven? Is there anybody that you only want to pick? If not, are you willing to trade back? You guys tell me because we need to figure this out, bro. We're going to do this tonight. We're going to figure this out together, fellas. I want to know what you guys are thinking. Oh, man, I love it. I love it. Uh, Over Chicken says, Tom Grossi's video about the Diggs trade is funny. I haven't seen it. I don't really watch him like that. Sometimes his Titan stuff will pop up uh, for me to watch, but I don't I don't really follow him like that. Uh, Sergio says, what are the chances we get Justin Simmons? I don't know, bro. Like, hopefully we get him. Hell yeah, hopefully. Hey, pause for the cause. Let's get those thumbs up, fellas. Come on, you guys. Let's get those thumbs up. Let's get them up, fellas. Let's get them up. Live every single day, man. Remember, my name is Titan Anderson. You can't spell Titans without putting that T-A in it. Uh, chat section, would you guys want to bring in Justin Simmons? How would you guys feel about that? I think he'd be perfect for our safeties. I think he'd be perfect, and we wouldn't even need to worry about safety in the draft. I mean, you always could, but I wouldn't worry about it. Mialine says, do you think... Do you, do you think you should have won Fan of the Year, you or Tom Grossi? Um... Who did win fan of the year? Wasn't it Tom Grossi? Who who was the who was the fan fan of the year? Not team of the fan of the year, but who was the fan of the year? Does anybody even know? Um, and and I couldn't last year I I don't think I even deserved it. Like, I mean, sure, but I think I think anybody, if anybody was to beat Chili Pepper, I think that would have been disrespectful to uh to the franchise. Um he literally flies to every like every game, like every single game. That's expensive as shit. Um, so again, I, I think um, I think I will win fan of the year eventually. It's gonna happen. I'm I mean I'm not that. I'll be 34 this this month, uh, so I'll, I'll win eventually. Um, whenever that happens, I don't know, but I think um, I, I think Chili Pepper deserved it. Like to be honest, like and that's just being real. That's just me being real. Uh, Gorilla Tag says, I like the, t I love the Titans. Yes. Charlotte says, we need Joe Alt. Hey, man. We'll see. Uh, let's see. Um, let's see. Tyler says, Ridley is a number two receiver at best on a great team. If you argue, Dogs is old. D Hop is old. Dude, you don't, you don't understand football if you think Calvin Ridley is a number two. Like, you don't know football at all. So it doesn't make any sense even arguing with you. Uh, J-Bell says, that's why the Titans have a legit secondary. Don't forget, we have a ball-hawking safety Amani Hooker. Amani Hooker's really good when he's healthy and, and able to play the, the ball-hawking safety role. Um, we, we He needs some help. Justin Simmons and him would be a great pair, you guys. It really would. You're bringing in somebody that that is in his prime still, and um, and and he brings experience and, and that leadership-type that you could really use for a, a team that's not maybe not as experienced on the defensive side of things. I think that, that would be a great pickup, honestly. You guys, we're uh, we're closing in on the 25-minute mark. Uh, we have a two-hour show, you guys, so make sure you guys pause for the cause, hit the like button, continue to comment, subscribe, do all that fun stuff. Get those emojis flapping, bro. I love it. Uh, Jason says, Justin Simmons linked up the Titans. Uh, let's see. Uh, Mialine says, who is your favorite Titans player of all time? Um, it, it's Derrick Henry. It, it, it's Derrick Henry and, and Chris Johnson. Um, I think... Um, I think I think I got to give it some time. I think I need, I need to let Derrick Henry be away from the team for a little bit, and then I'll reevaluate. Uh, but but Derrick Henry and Chris Johnson... Um, man, fuck. I mean, Steve McNair, he's up there too. Uh, I think those are my top three players for the Tennessee Titans is is uh, Derrick Henry, um, Chris Johnson, and Eddie jo or uh, and Steve McNair. Eddie George is in my top five, and then I think I got uh, I think I got Jarrell Casey, Jarrell Casey to finish it out. Uh, Jarrell Casey is the nicest person, nicest Titan I've ever I've ever talked to. 
like the the realness. He is the most real person. Even after the contract that he got, the massive contract that he got from us, still still talked to me three four times. Great, not long conversations. I'm not gonna try to act like it was, uh, but very respectful. Holy. Like, holy shit, bro. Like, one of the most respectful people. You don't even have to. Like, I'm just some... And this is, I mean, a few years ago, bro. Think about it. One of the most real people I've ever... I mean, seriously, bro. Like, man. Yeah. So, I, I just... I got too much respect for him, honestly. I really do. I have so much respect for him. I, I should do a top 10 list. That'd be dope, right? A top 10 Titans of all time list. For me, my favorite. Uh, that'd be cool. Uh, appreciate you, Mealing. Uh, Charlotte says, what other quarterback can throw for 80 yards in the NFL? Uh, in pads, I think, um, well, I know Will Levis can. I think Josh Allen has a real real opportunity. Um, who else can throw fucking far? Patrick Mahomes, maybe. Um, I don't know. I, I can't think off the top of my head. Uh, I know Aaron Rodgers probably used to be able to. I don't know about now. But there's 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 been there's been some guys who can really launch that shit. You know what I mean? I love it, man. I love it. Levis! Will Levis. We excited about Will Levis, fellas? Let's go, man. Uh, Titan Boy Blazing says, bro, Diggs about to get them handcuffs put on them. Baby, let's go lock it up. Come on, speak to him, Titan Boy Blazing. Speak to him. Let those bitches know they ain't catching shit. This shit. We locking them in, baby. We locking them in. They ain't going nowhere. Come on. Let's go. Get the ribeyes out. Barbecue them up. We go in the war. Come on. Sneed indeed, baby. Let's go. The need for Sneed in two-tone blue is true. Woo. Come on. Damn. I love it, bro. Fuck yeah, man. I love this shit. JC on said, Tom Brady says he sees himself in Will. I know, man. I, I did a YouTube short about that, man. We're going to start dropping those, uh, dropping those like, uh, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, it's um, it's pretty cool. I got a lot of different ones, too. We got uh, some game day eats and game day drinks that we're going to bring back as well. So, uh, like I said, it, it's because we've been waiting for the memberships to come back that, that we're kind of uh, evolving and changing with it. So, um, again, I recommend everybody and anybody that wants to join this this family, you know what I'm saying? Join the membership. It's only like $2.99, like cheaper than a Starbucks tiny cup of coffee. It's crazy, bro. Like, let's start there. Uh, cheaper than a, cheaper than a shot. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. It's crazy. So, uh, yeah, make sure you guys check it out. It's pinned at the, the link is pinned at the top of the chat, man. Make sure you guys check it out. Yes, sir. And we only keep it at three dollars because we don't want it to really be expensive. You know what I'm saying? We, we, we would rather you guys just, you know, you, you guys be here. Yeah, that means the most. But I appreciate everybody. Hell yeah, man. We're not even one fourth of the way done. We're not even a half a, a half hour in, and we're going for two hours. You guys, can we try to get those likes up? Let's get those likes up, fellas. Come on. Uh, let's see. Charlotte says T A. Okay, I think I already read that one. Uh, J C on says your son is the genie. Tell your son T A. Say we going fourteen and three. <laughs> I'll talk to him, bro. I'll talk to him. I got you. Uh, let's see. Mar Mar Marconi Tenorio Kimolin. Well, that's a that's a name, bro. I probably killed it. I'm sorry, bro. Uh, can the Bills sign a wide receiver? The Bills will be using their first round pick on a wide receiver, and I'm expecting them to try to trade for like go get one, go get Higgins or somebody. Like what the fuck? Are you? Go get Brandon Ayuk. Like what are you doing, bro? Brandon Ayuk would be a good ass pickup for the Bills who like to do all that trick trick shit. I think that'd be a great pickup for them. Like, come on, what are you doing? Don't leave Josh Allen out in the cold naked. Like, you know what I mean? This is crazy. Oh, man. Hey, Titans fans, are we ready to score 30 points this year? I need I need to hear from my people, though. My Teutonians, y'all talk to me. Are we ready? Can we spam 30 points? It's going to feel so good when we score 30 points, bro. I can't fucking wait. Uh, JC on says, I can't wait to see Fulton in L.A. getting cooked. Dude, I can't wait. I can't stand that fucking guy. What a liar. What a terrible teammate. What a terrible player. Titan fan says, TA, what if Vikings trade with Cardinals and Chargers take Alt at five and Giants take Marvin Harrison Jr. and then Titans take Neighbors at seven? Again, I'm for that. Everybody knows Marvin Harrison Jr., Malik Neighbors, and Joe Alt are my top three players to get in the draft. Otherwise, I'm trading back. Facts. Uh, Overchicken says, I heard Arizona really wants to trade back from four. I've heard similar things to that sort. 
um, again, perfect spot for the Vikings to move up and get their quarterback. It really is. I really think that they, they that's what they should do. I don't know if, I mean, I don't, that's what's crazy about the draft, bro. Nobody knows, bro. Nobody knows. Maybe Elon Musk knows planting fucking chips in people's brains and shit. Maybe he knows, but we. I don't, I don't fucking know, bro. I don't fucking know, bro. I don't know, man. Shout out to Elon, though. Shout out to Elon. Uh, let's see. Afio says, would you trade Burks TA? I, uh, I keep hearing possible possibility possibly it's coming i oh man i'm so 50 50 on it bro like honestly we saw we see how good he can possibly be especially think about it in a limited role a situational rotational role like he could really do work bro he would never have to be super tired out there because he's not starting he'll get to learn from ridley and d hop like i don't want to let him go but if we were to trade him you got to give us a third bro i don't i mean I, I could we even get a third you know what I mean? Like, I wouldn't want anything under a fourth. I'd feel like shit. So it's just like, I don't know, bro. What do you guys think, man? Because I, I know Rand Carthon. Like, we got, look at that. We got Josh Wiley, respectively, with a fourth. Ty J with a third last year. We got uh, fucking Will Levis with, sorry, Will, <laughs> with a, with our second. And then Peter Skaronsky with our first. That's crazy, bro. Like, I believe Rand Carthon can make things work, make it happen. I love it, bro. I love it. Oh, uh, let's see. Uh, Liam says, bro. I got COVID, bro. You make my day, bro. Man, hey, man, you're still sick. You got COVID and it's that bad. I I had COVID uh, twice and um, yeah, it's it's not fun, bro. Make sure you you like when you when you're when you get over this, bro. Uh, make sure you drink a lot of real orange juice. Like like don't get that shit from the store that's like all fake. Or like the Donald Duck shit. Sorry, Donald Duck. That you're you're not real orange juice. She's not. Get the freshly squeezed shit from the store. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah. Go get the real stuff. Go drink that and drink a lot of water, bro. Drink more of that stuff and eat healthier. Stop eating chips, bro. Stop eating them Reese's at 12 at night. Watching Shogun. And come on, bro. Don't 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 think. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You gotta you gotta take care of yourself, bro. Uh, no real shit though. Jokes aside. Um, get better, bro. Drink water and 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 that that. Uh, that, that that thing I told you about the orange juice is for real. I promise you. Straight up. I love it, man. Hit that like button, fellas. What are we doing here? Let's get it. He said Titan suck. You're out of your damn mind. That's pretty wild, man. I'm so excited about this season. What's up, Chris? How you doing, bro? How you doing? What's up, 53? Big dog, I see you, bro. Good to see you, big dog. Yes, sir. Yeah, he says, because you're at least favorite Titans player. Dude, what? He says, who's your least favorite Titans player? Um, I mean, my least favorite Titans player of all time is Panda Wilson. Um, my least favorite Titans player on the team that's still on the team right now would be... Malik Willis. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, shit. Cassidy says Texans will be hard to beat, but Jacksonville will be, will be a close second. Yeah, I, we'll see what Jacksonville does. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm sure they're still upset and, you know, crying in the corner in the fetal position. Um, it's going to be interesting to see how they respond from that heartbreak that we we uh, happily sent them. Uh, I'm still I'm still celebrating and um, I, I try to watch watch the highlights of that game at least twice a day to keep to keep my smile on my face, uh, you know. So I, I appreciate the Jaguars for being that shitty ass team that we can continue to ruin their lives and continue to meet to beat them and make them look like they're mediocre at best. So I appreciate it. I love it, man. Yeah, I already, yeah, I already got. I, I heard. I, yeah, I know what you were saying, bro. Who was my least favorite? I, I figured that's what you were saying, to be honest. Wesley Woodyard, shout out to him, bro. Lady Titan, man, the wife, the wife is love you too, babe. Twenty seven. It's actually been longer than that. It's crazy, bro. It's fucking been crazy. K. Will, what's up, bro? Uh, Richard Richard Johnson has an interesting one. You guys, what do you think about this? He says, how many times during games have you seen Diggs arguing on sidelines with coaches? And and uh, quarterback a cancer like I said, bro. He argues all the time with players when he, especially when he doesn't get the ball. It's wild. So that's what I'm saying. Like, have fun with that. Have fun with that. She said, "Yo, his wife's in the stream." 
Yeah, oh yeah, she always in here, man. She's like, she's like, you know what I'm saying? She's like, have you ever heard that? What do they say in that Spider-Man movie or whatever? That 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 uh, that pudgy kid. He was like, he's like, can I be can I be your guy in the chair <laughs> or something like? He said some shit like that. Yeah, she she she's holding it down, man. He says, what, what's your second favorite NFL team? I don't have one. I don't care about any any other team but the Titans. Uh, T.A., would you like to sign David uh, Bakhtiari? I don't know. It, I don't know. To be honest, I, I'm not sure. I, I would have to to see how how he looks still. You know what I mean? Like, that fool was in that Pitch Perfect movie, bro. And if you know, you know. That means he's been around fucking forever. Oh, man. Lou, man, that's pretty good. He says, my top 10 Titans are Pac-Man, Parker, Hesse, Tierra, my friend Tart. You, oh, you really know him? That's crazy. Tana Wills, Henry, Frank, Burst, Bistroni, Ron, Butler. Okay, that's what's up, bro. Seems like they're more like personal type favorites. Shannon says, we definitely need to beef up our O-line. That's a fact. Everybody knows that. Everybody knows that and knows it's coming. Uh, Charlotte says, Titans are going to draft baby T.A. Hey, if they're smart, they'll draft little T.A. My oldest son, he's big, man. He'll be eight in May and... He big, man. He's big. He's strong. He's so strong. 30 points, man. I want it to happen so bad, bro. I want it to happen so bad. Like, we haven't done it in so long. It's fucking ridiculous. The CWB says, hi, I love your videos, and I would love if you could shout out my friend. Yeah, now nah, we ain't doing that. That's embarrassing how, that's embarrassing how you're going to say that. You're going to try to do that stupid shit to try to say me, have me say that. And you're gonna do the autistic thing at the same time. That's crazy. So yeah, you, you you've been blocked. I'm surprised you got you 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 mods didn't block him. That's surprising to me. It's clear as day. Anything like that, like you don't need any permission. That's crazy to me. Like the fact that people are gonna sit there and dis, like that's crazy. Holy crap. Sad, sad people. Sad people that live in this world. I'll tell you that much. It's 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 sad. Aaron says, send d -Hop back to Houston. We need another receiver. Nah, bro, I think we both got enough. We're both ready to go. Uh, to be honest, enough is a strong word. We both could add more. We'll see, bro. We'll see. Um, Richard, my mother-in-law just got COVID last week. Yeah, bro, just, just stay hydrated, man. Literally. Oh, man. He says, hey, your team is the best. My team is working their ass off to be the best. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you that much. I'll tell you that much. I'll tell you that much. Don't think it. You know what I mean? I love it, bro. Fucking love it. We'll see if Diggs can do it, though. Uh, Titan Boy Blazing says, bro, you add Justin Simmons, and just like that, we, we, some, we something scary. Let's go. And, again, he just he, he's one of those players that, just can, that you can just put – uh, you know, into the starting lineup, and he's gonna be a true pro right away. And he's very good, man. He's so damn uh, his IQ, his football IQ is is to me his best attribute. He's so smart, football smart, man. It's crazy. Little one says, "Who's your least favorite team?" Easily the Jacksonville Jungle Kitty Cats. Uh, K Will says, T.A., you think you can get the Titans fans to show their man caves? Because I have one almost ready for the season. I, yeah, man, maybe. Maybe. I mean, if that's it, you know, if that's something that we wanted to do, we could, you know what I'm saying? I'm down. Fuck it. Richard, I, I see you, bro. I appreciate you. Wow. Bill's fan says, what about that digs? Bro, I don't even know what to tell you. I feel bad for you, to be honest. Like, I don't even, it's crazy. Like, it's so crazy, bro. Oh, man, it feels so good having good weapons everywhere. I love it. What's up, Shazam? Uh, Shazam says, O-line, but man, if Joe ain't there, I, I want big Brock Bowers, and I just don't think that's going to happen, bro. But what do you guys think? Maybe, maybe not. Maybe, maybe not. Big Dog says, uh, we still need to patch some holes on this defense. That's a fact. That's a fact. What do you guys think? What do you guys think about that? Uh, what do you guys think about that Stefan Diggs trade? What do you guys think about it? Put it in the comment section below. Thanks, Bills fans. Appreciate it. 
Uh, Michael M says, Rand is going to surprise us in the draft. I have no reason not to trust him at this point. I'm with you. I'm with you, bro. I believe every, I believe in Rand. I, I, I truly do. I truly do. He's given us no reason. He's given us no reason for us not to trust him. Hey, you guys, let's pause for the call. Hit that like button, comment, subscribe. Let's get it. Screaming, no, 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 yes. <laughs> Let's go. I'm still thirsty. What the fuck? Wow, that's delicious. Now, 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 now you know you're ready to talk some football. Uh, who? Yeah, who's your man? Just chill, bro. You good? Yeah, man. Make sure you guys get those likes up, comment, subscribe, man. It's been a fun show so far. Uh, Titans, Texans, man. Both with brand new offenses. It's crazy, right? It's crazy to think about it, but uh, the Texans came shooting back last year, ready to go, guns blazing, and. Um, they took the division. They took the division when nobody thought they were going to do that. C.J. Stroud seems like he's going to be the real deal. I call him Jason Voorhees. Let's go and get his ass. Let's go and make sure that he cannot sit there all day in the pocket. What did we do to make sure that we can try to combat what he's going to do? We went out and got two legitimate number one corners in the NFL. Legereus Sneed shut down. Roger McCreary respectfully was already on the team. Uh, but he'll be in the middle, you know, holding it down. Not Now he don't have to bounce around like fucking Bugs Bunny. He can just sit where he needs to sit. And then Cheeto, Jadobia Wuzie from the Bengals. Oh, my, oh, my. Uh, Titan Boy says, Cash App, bro, I'm trying to support the cause. Cash App is money sign Titan Anderson. Whoever sends money to the Cash App, send a, send a, uh, send a message so we can read it off live for you guys. I'd greatly appreciate that. All my mods, I appreciate you guys down there. I see you got what you guys are doing. Uh, Afio says, what's Texans secondary uh, look like? The Texans secondary, you know, there's, um, I'll bring up the depth charts right now, but there's um, there's one guy that me and my buddy talked about uh, going into, um, going into, uh, um, what was it, last year's or no, two years ago, uh, when they got, um, hold on, where is it at? Texans depth chart, I'm going to bring it up. Because he's, um, um, the, uh, Stingley, my, my older brother is an LSU fan. So, so, uh, ever since Stingley w was on LSU, we, uh, he's always told me about that guy. He's all, that's somebody you're going to want to look out for. Uh, he, like he only pays attention to his LSU guys really for the most part. Shout out to Will, but, uh, yeah. Um, and, and, and so that was his favorite guy coming out of college that year. And, he, and he's like, damn, dude, the Texans got a beast. And I know that, that he kind of struggled injuries, this, this, and that. But uh, Derek Stingley Jr., if you guys have seen what he's become, it's crazy. Uh, they have uh, Jalen Pitry as free safety. Jimmy Ward, it says. Jeff Okuda. Um, check the, but, 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 don't, but don't forget about who they do have. Aziz al Shair. Keep listening. Danico... Autry. They went out and took two of our starters from last season. Oh, yeah. Don't forget. They have Daniel Hunter on the opposite side of Will Anderson Jr. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's crazy, bro. Like, hey, don't, don't sleep on the Texans. Like I said, man, they're favorites right now. We all know that. We respect that. There's no problem with that. But as Titans fans, you know what my problem is? My problem is that is that nobody even thinks the Titans have a chance. That's my problem. That's bullshit. Titans no chance. Get the fuck out of here. That don't make no damn sense. But yeah, Stingley Jr. is very good, you guys. And um, even even last year and, and seeing what he what he was able to do, he just man, he's just doesn't have many many flaws at all, if any. He's really good, really good. Appreciate you guys, man. Hell yeah. <laughs> Big Dog says, we need some serious speed over here. Hey, we're... <laughs> 
I can't wait to play these Texans, bro. These live stream watch parties that we're going to host are going to be crazy. Hey, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button if you haven't already, man. We are closing in on 14,500. We are almost there. Hey, man, I want to give a shout out. Uh, he did, uh, uh, Kelvin, you did send them. I appreciate that. He says, uh, since 20, wow, I appreciate it, bro. $20 for, he says, for I bleed that two-tone blue. That's what, that's what I, I appreciate that, man. Thanks, bro. Yes, sir. I know how it is, bro. It's crazy, right? It's crazy how you can love uh, a football team so much. Like, it's crazy, but there, it is what it is. It, this is, this is what we do, guys. This is what we do. We talk football. We, we, we root for this. I mean, I'm, I'm curious. How many of you guys watching have never seen one of the live game watch parties from, uh, from when, when, from what we're known for? How, how many of you have not seen it? Put it in the chat section below. I'm just curious. I'm just really curious. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. I'm just like, seriously, I think that's something that I kind of need to know. Like, <laughs> that's crazy. Uh, let's see. Baguette, you're wild, bro. Like, for real, what are you doing? Uh, let's see. He says the trade is good. Okay. Colts and Jags in trouble. AFC South predictions. We'll talk about that in a little bit. Uh, Key West says, Callahan going to get us right. Offensive coach, we needed that. Facts. Facts. Nod Wynn says, we need a nickname for Sneed and then boys. Maybe the Titanium Titans. We go, it, it, It'll naturally come. Don't worry about it. Don't even worry about it. Uh, Charlotte says, what if Jacksonville is drafting baby TA? That ain't happening. Fuck that. We're going to do the Eli Manning treatment. Fuck that. Nope. Wait till the next round if we have to. Fuck that. Stoner Titan says, T.A., I heard J.J. Watt was bragging, saying Texans will dominate the AFC South for years. What a crazy dude. Fanny says, T.A., you like baseball? Not really. I like uh, I like uh, Acuna and the Braves, though. I like Acuna. He's dope. But I don't really like baseball. It's too slow. <laughs> oh, he said you should make a short dissing one. Ah, oh, man, that's funny. Sam, Wow. He said, are you a Titans fan? That's the craziest thing I've ever heard. Uh, Jay Bell says, I, I believe Calvin really can handle Stingley. I'm sure he can, bro, but if there's anybody who can handle him, Stingley, Stingley's, not, Stingley's a beast, bro. Like, he really is good. He really, really is good. Um, but so is Ridley. So let's go to war. Like I said, let's go to war, bro. I'm ready for it. Fucking J.J. Watt, man. What a crybaby. Uh, Over Chicken says, I miss football live streams. Yes, sir. He says, do you watch college football? Yes, I do. I, I watch college football. TA makes the streams better with his reactions. Thanks, bro. Oh, man. Uh, Richard says, I watched the Titans between ops while in Afghanistan and Iraq. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy. Appreciate you, uh, Dimitri. Yeah, appreciate you. Uh, that's crazy, bro. For real, that's wild. There's a lot of people who are, you know what I'm saying? Who There's a lot of people who watch, you know, not just my channel, but, I, you know, just speaking on my channel specifically, there's a lot of people who who have messaged me saying that they, that they can only watch or listen or hear you know, or get their news from me. It's crazy. I and mean, when you hear shit like that, it's like, whoa. Like that, that's, it's pretty cool, man. I, 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 I appreciate all you guys more than you know. Like, seriously, I know I say it all the time, but it's true. He says, what is your favorite college team? I am subbed. I follow players now. Like, I stopped, I stopped having a college football team a long time ago. Uh, I didn't, like I said, I, I like to just follow the players because... I love the Titans too much to to even really care too much about another sports team other than the Warriors because of Curry, um, but I I just I yeah I don't know man it's appreciate you man thank you hell yeah we're close hey man we still have over an hour to go you guys let's go man I appreciate everybody man let's get it let's get it. Derek Smith, what's up, bro? Tighten up. I see you. I see you. 
Who's man? Yeah, who's your man? You gotta stop with that, bro. You're acting like a fucking four year old. That's crazy. That's crazy. Uh, little one says you're my favorite YouTuber. Can you guess what my team is? I don't. I don't know what the fuck your team is. How about probably probably the Colts? You sound like a Colts fan. I could be wrong. Titan Saucy says yeah. Back when I used to listen to your live during work. That's what I'm saying. It's like uh, there's people who would tell me like you know I. Like, your, your lives are the, or your videos or whatever, you know, are the only way I could listen to, you know, Titans content or whatever. And that's just crazy when you hear that. But it's cool, man. I appreciate it. I really do. It's cool. That Chiefs Nation. That's crazy, though. Let's start there. Oh, my God. The Chiefs? The Chiefs, bro? What are we doing here? What are we doing here? Yeah, that's way too much. I need to brighten this up a little bit. All right. Yeah, the Texans got a solid team, though. Clear as day, clear as day. Their team is solid, bro. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to do what we do best and have to really compete. We're gonna have to really compete because the Titans are, the Titans are still. Uh, we got way more holes than they do on defense. That's that's not even debatable. You know what I mean? So, I know. All right, so let's check this out real quick. So, let's go over the Titans roster real quick. They've got uh, Will Levis. Obviously, Mason Rudolph and Malik Willis will be battling it out. Tony Pollard and Spears, uh, DeAndre Hopkins, um, Calvin Ridley, NWI is still there, Kinsey, Colton Dow, Traylon Burks, Kyle Phillips, Kiaras Jackson, Chig Okonkwo, Josh Wiley, uh, NPF, Jalen Duncan, Peter Skaronsky, Sadiq Charles, Lloyd Cushenberry, Daniel Brunskill, uh, and Dylan Radunz. Uh, Dylan Radons needs to go. Like <laughs> he's just not good. It just it is what it is. You are not good, bro. It is what it is. It is what it is. Um, you know, here's our defense, you guys. And of course, the defense is nowhere near ready. Uh, but they got a uh, Sebastian Joseph. Um, you know, as the DE. Uh, I I think he I I think we need something else. Um, Sebastian, more of a situational player. Jeffrey Simmons. Uh, and then you got Shadobia Wuzier and Roger McCreary, Elijah Molden, uh, Jack Gibby, and uh, you know Otis Reith. O Otis Reese, I think, believe uh, believe it or not, de deserves an opportunity. Jack Gib Gibbons is just he's just slow. You know what I mean? He's just slow. Uh, we got Legarius Sneed, Caleb Farley, Eric Gar, um, Kenneth Murray Jr., Arden Key, Caleb Murphy. Elijah Molden and Amani Hooker are listed as our safeties. And Elijah Molden just is not a natural safety. He needs to be a floater on this defense. Um, so, yeah, it's kind of interesting in its own right. But the Titans should have no problem scoring 30 points. Should have no problems at all. What do you guys think? Charlotte, go Titans. Yes, sir. Click that like button, fellas. Click that like button. Subscribe, subscribe. Let's go. Man, this is crazy. Who do you guys want to draft in the NFL draft? Put your team's name and put your player who you want to draft in the comment section below. Appreciate you guys, everybody, for holding it down in the comment section, man. You guys are dope. You guys are killing it tonight. Appreciate it, man. Titanium Chris says, what up, TA? What about Bud Dupree? I think he's still... A oh, hell no. That guy's a tomato can. That dude's a tomato can, bro. Bear says Arden Key's a good rotational pass rusher. Yeah, and that's where he belongs. He just isn't a starter. He's just not. He's just not a starter. Yeah, Titans. Okay, he says Titans Malik neighbors. Niners or Commanders? Probably Drake May. I know King Henry, man. That's crazy. It's, it's so weird, right, that King Henry's not on the team. Everybody hit that like button. Come on, man. we got over 100 people watching. Let's get that like button flowing. Let's get that subscribe button flowing. Let's hit that 14,500 right now. Come on, fellas. Hit that 14,500, man. Let's go. Let's go. Yes, sir. What is that? All right. All right, let's get it. Let's get it. Let me turn this over here. That'd be pretty cool. 
Yeah, Julian says, Titans, Joe Alt, or Neighbors? Malik Neighbors need to play for the Tennessee Titans. Dude, that'd be so crazy, right? Can you imagine that explosion? It would be insane, bro. Uh, man. Joe Alt or Neighbors? Are you guys, how do you guys feel about Marvin Harrison Jr. to the Titans? Do you guys just think it's 100% impossible? Like, you guys tell me. How do you guys feel about that? How do you guys feel about that? How do you guys feel about Marvin Harrison? Marvin Harrison Jr., yes or no in the chat? Spam it. Let's go. You guys let me know. I'm just curious. I'm, I'm going to keep it 100. I'm, I'm just, I'm really curious. Yeah. <laughs> That's, what the fuck is this? What? Weird ass notification. Okay, I see what that was. That's cool. I appreciate that, bro. That's crazy. I don't know who that is. He says, I damn, no, I don't want Marvin Harrison Jr. over chicken. Donovan says worth watching. Uh definitely okay. Uh who's your man, dude? All right. Yeah, buddy. Now nah, we got it. We got. We got. Yeah, enough of that shit. That's ridiculous. Michael says. Uh, yeah, no, that's weird. I don't know. I don't know what happened with that. Michael, you good, bro? Uh, Lateral crew says Marvin Harrison Jr. is only possible if three quarterbacks go. Chargers take Alt and Giants take Neighbors over him. I don't see any of that happening. Four quarterbacks going. Chargers aren't going Alt, and if. They do. Giants ain't passing. Hey, we we also didn't think nobody, nobody in the world thought that the thought that the Texans were gonna get C.J. Stroud and Will Anderson. Nobody did. Nobody, nobody in the world got that right. Not one person. So again, it's just a it's just a thing. Uh, Titan fan says would love to have him, but we ain't moving up to get him, and he is a top five at least. You know, some people think Malik Neighbors is ahead of him. We'll see if it's all cap. Maybe it is. It, it probably is. I love it, man. Yes, sir, man. Big Dog says, don't sleep on the Titans. That's what I'm talking about. I love it, man. EC3, back in the building. EC3, welcome to the membership, bro. Appreciate you. Appreciate you, man. Welcome back. If anybody wants to join the membership, it's pinned. the link is pinned at the top of the chat, man. Join us, join us, join us. Bro, I need to, like, this is crazy, bro. Like, this is super crazy. Like, what are we doing here? We're at the one hour mark, you guys. We have one more hour to go. Let's read the, the, the poll. Who has the better offense, Titans or Texans, with 220 votes? 47% Titans, 53% Texans. And again, this is it's a lot closer than I actually assumed. That's crazy. That's crazy. The Tennessee Titans fans probably voting a lot for their team, which is respectful. Nothing wrong with that. But I, I really believe that we could compete. I really believe that the Texans, if they beat us this year, they're going to have to earn it. You better earn it because the Titans are not going to be easy to beat at all, bro. I know a lot of people don't think he's going to be there. All right, how about, how about this? Uh, chat, how, do you, how would you guys feel about trading back? How would you guys feel about trading back? Everybody answer it. Titans trading back from seven to wherever. Yes or no? You can explain why if you want to. Yes, sir. Get those likes up, fellas. Get those likes up, fellas. Let's go. Let's go. Appreciate you guys, man. Yeah, buddy. Yes, sir. That's just crazy. I said no. Nah, I think... Nah, that's not it, bro. Yeah, that's not it. What do you guys think about them Texans new <laughs> the new uniforms, man? Those are so corny, man. I don't I don't understand it. I don't understand it. I do not understand those uniforms. The Texans uniforms are fuck, bro. They I think they I think they messed up on that one. I think the Texans messed up on that one. It's pretty interesting. It's pretty interesting. Uh Titanus says if Alt or Neighbors is there, do not trade back. 
Uh, Lateral Crew says, only one trade back I'm okay with. Moving back to 8 or 9 if Chicago or Atlanta are trying to jump each other for Turner, where you could acquire a third and still get alt. Okay, okay. Earth, uh, he says, thanks for the welcome. <laughs> Appreciate you, bro. I know. Do you guys think? Uh, do you guys think that the digs, the digs pickup, is a big pickup for the Texans, or is it overrated? You guys tell me. Titanus says Texans went from trash jerseys to even worse jersey. <laughs> I don't know what they were thinking. I'm gonna keep it. A, I'm gonna keep it hundred. I have no idea what they were thinking. I think that that jersey looks terrible. I think that their new jerseys look terrible, bro. It's crazy. I'm gonna turn the lights on. Hold on. What's up, fellas? Nice and clear, baby. <laughs> How we doing, fellas? How we doing? Yes, sir. We nice and clear. Can you guys see us? We good? We good. Let's do the second half with the lights on. Pause. Hell yeah, I can't wait, man. Make sure you guys hit that membership as well, you guys. I love it. I love it. Let's see. Let's see. What are we doing? Uh, lateral says the Diggs trade is awful regressing and they put him on a prove it deal so if he balls out they can't retain him and if he doesn't and he continues to regress they lost their second that's crazy that's the, I'm glad that's not our problem my god Ashton says good but Sneed's gonna lock his ass down when we play him easy money easy money uh, Big Dog says Levis would straight up body slam. <laughs> Will Levis is different. Oh, that dude is just a different type of beast. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be on. I'm gonna keep it a hundred. Appreciate you, EC3. Yes, sir. Let's go. Titan fan says, uh, no, due to our O line needing help, especially when we got one of the best wide receiver duo, which we haven't even, which we haven't had in a long time. Will Levis needs some time to hit them bombs, which we all know he can do. That's a fact. That's a fact, bro. Yes, sir. Let's get those likes up, you guys. Let's get those likes up to 50, you guys. We closing in. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, man, I can't wait. Ashton says, Titan Anderson, do you think we have any 325 games this year? I'm sure. I'm sure there's some. I'm sure, bro. I'm sure. Titan South, 25 months. Thanks, bro. Sneed getting a pick six on Stroud and Richardson, bro. That would be fucking hilarious. I hope so. I hope so. I'm going to keep it 100. I hope so, bro. We'll see what happens. It's going to be good. It's going to be good. The Titans have some some dogs on the outside now. So it's um, it's going to be interesting to see, you know, these corners that we have lining up. And if, and if we can just get that pass rush going as well, this team can go as far as we want to go, whether the mainstream media or, or haters in general want to admit it or not. Let's just go out there and, and continue to build this team. And then when we go into week one, look out. Boom. Apparently the Texans just acquired Julio 2.0. Oh, man. Uh, Titan fan says, TA, what if Levis throws six touchdowns in one game to beat Strouds? Uh, or did he heat five touchdowns? I, don't, I have no idea, bro. I'm not really sure. You'd have to tell me. Uh, J. George says, just got here and took the poll. Titans got to prove it for me. I give them any, uh, before I give them any credit, I'm excited and hopeful they will be better, but I got to give it to Houston. Thanks, Vrabel. <laughs> Appreciate you, bro. OC615 says, keep seven. Trade 32 for a future first round. Uh, you mean 38? Uh, let's see. Ashton says, "Are you gonna charge? Are you going to the Chargers game?" Yeah, I'm gonna be at the Chargers game. Yes, sir. Uh, that's cr what? That's wild. <laughs> What's up, Michael? How you doing, bro? Uh shit. You guys are wild. You guys are wild today, bro. Some of the, some of the stuff that I. <laughs> Some of the stuff that I read, that especially the some of the stuff that I don't read out loud, is like, oh man, don't think I don't see it, but oh shit. 
That's hilarious to me. That's hilarious. Hey, how do you guys feel about Ty J Spears going forward, you guys? I know we got Tony Pollard. I'd love to hear what you guys think about our running backs. Do you guys think this is an upgrade? Uh, you know, not having Henry anymore, we're going to be a more, uh, you know, open offense, if you will. Um, having two running backs that are very good, that, that are uh, dual threat running backs, but different style dual threat running backs. Let me know what you guys think about that. Ty J Spears, uh, by, the uh, by the way, 60 uh, times 65 minutes. Um, let me know what you guys think about that because Ty J Spears and, um, and, and Tony Pollard together, bro. Like imagine them, like I said, we saw Derrick Henry and, and, uh, Ty J together last year at the same time in many different types of situations and doing different, different plays from that format, from the formation and everything. It's crazy. And I think that, um, I think that these guys, you could do so much, so many things as well. I think, um, Having them both out there in the shotgun with the, the three receivers and whatever else we bring in is going to be so exciting to see. Uh, Will Levis is going to give our receivers so many opportunities to, uh, to you know, make plays. If you're one-on-one, -on -one, go win your one-on-one, -on -one, but you better not let them intercept the ball. If you're in a bad position, just knock the ball down. But he's going to give you every opportunity to go out there and play old-school football and go catch those touchdowns. It's going to be fun. It's going to be really fun. Uh, Liam says, "Ta, should we get Justin? Take Justin Simmons or David Bucatiari if you could choose? I'm taking uh, Justin Simmons to go and pair with, uh, um, well, Elijah Molden would then move away. Amani Hooker would, uh, and and uh, Simmons would be nice to me. I think that'd be a really nice combo." Uh, Jr. says, "I don't get how people can hate on the the Ridley grab and hype the Diggs trade." They gave up a second for Diggs, and he's almost 31. He's also a headache in cases. It makes Texans better, but come on. Um, or he said it certainly makes Texans better. Sorry. Um, I don't know. It's the same reason. Like, like people just don't like the Titans. I, I, it, it's, a weird, it's a weird thing, but it's just it's true. It, it is what it is. <clears throat> Kelly says Jaguars are winning it all. She's crazy. She's crazy. Excuse me. Oh, my God. Appreciate it, you guys. Oh, my God. Let's go, fellas. We're going to get 14500 today. I can promise you that much. Everybody hit that subscribe button. Uh, Titanus says, I want Spears to start. Not I'd win, says Spears is going to be special. Trust. Andrew says, I love the Titans. He says, get Rudolph a weapon. <laughs> uh, Lateral Cruz says, in the pass game, a huge upgrade. In the run game, it's a downgrade until we improve our tackles, which will probably be in the draft. Uh, true. Um, Julian says Spears is fast. Uh, Farmer, you got to quit with that trolling shit, bro. Senator says, I think I need to order a pizza and wings. Dude, I think every, that sounds good, to be honest. Damien says Packers for life. That's wild. Hey, good luck this year, though. You, we don't really have shit to do with y'all. Lumen says, I think we will have three running backs. T uh, Frank Gore Jr. You want Frank Gore Jr.? You like that guy? We'll see you, bro. Uh, Kat Nelson says Spears and Pollard will be a dynamic duo. It really is going to be. It's going to be fun to watch, man. Aren't you guys excited to see what Pollard is going to do fully healthy uh, with Ty J Spears? Remember, Ty J Spears switched to number two. Is there anybody out there in the chat that's going to get a number two Ty J Spears jersey? No cap. J. George says all starts with the O-line, but I love the way Spears ran. He had some something to prove every time he touched the ball. If he keeps uh, that up, the sky's the limit. Exactly. Exactly. I love it, bro. Uh, Titan fan says, now that we are a spread offense, we need them both to be catching these wheel route. And I think uh, Spears is better is a better blocker, though. They both can do a little bit of both. Um, Spears is a little bit more dynamic, explosive, better agility. Uh, but Pollard is a he's tough man. He's tough and he's more explosive than than uh, he don't have a lot of top speed, but he's explosive as shit. He can get those through those holes fast, strong, uh, and again reliable can catch. I love it. I love it. Uh, nah, I'd win says they don't like us because we got that two-tone blue drip and the flaming tea. Let them hate, bro. It's all good. We don't care. We don't care, man. We know what's up. What's up, Rory? How you doing, buddy? Liam says, I can't wait to play against the Chargers and cook Fulton's ass more than barbecue chicken. <laughs> I just can't stand him. He's so fake, bro. He is so phony. 
That guy is as fake as it comes, bro. I promise you guys. He is... He's a fraud, bro. He's a fraud. Uh, Lateral Crew says, I'm for sure getting number two Spears jersey. It's the only only jersey I want. Respect, respect. Baseball. I know JR's been around. He's pretty cool, man. He's a good guy. He's a good guy. That's crazy. He said we play the... Yeah, we're going to play the Chargers. I, hopefully, hopefully it's a morning game, bro. Last time I went to L.A. to go watch... It was the Sunday night game against the Rams. I real and I'm gonna go this year to the the Charger game, and I want it to be a morning. I want it to be daylight out still. You know what I mean? I don't want it to be all super fucking cold or anything like that. I want it to be, you know. I want it. To, we'll see. Little one says Titans all day. Yes, sir. Liam says now I understand why we got 40 points scored on us. <laughs> don't worry, man. We're gonna be the people scoring 40 points from now on. We're definitely going to be the guys scoring 40 points from now on. Talk to me. Talk to me, people. I love it, man. I'm, I'm just so excited about this season, man. Let's just keep it 100. Our team is way better than last year. This team looks like it's a whole other team. Billy Scott says, you got to say that night game was crazy. We almost got into a fight. Yeah, it was crazy. Like when me and Billy Scott and my brother-in-law was there. Uh, you know, them, them Rams fans were talking so much shit above us, and we're just like, dude, this game just started, bro. What the fuck? And we ended up beating their ass. Uh, pause. And, um, you know, the Rams, the Titans beat the Rams. And, uh, yeah, they were they were pretty quiet. They were pretty quiet. And, I mean, well, yeah, we, we talked we talked some shit, but Billy Scott, you... <laughs> oh, shit. Billy is hilarious, man. He took a, He's just hilarious. I love it, man. Uh, Titans fan says, I want neighbors at seven. If he's there, then get two offensive tackles uh, in the second and fourth round. We, dude, that's crazy. I don't know. <laughs> it's crazy to think, bro, but it's di it's difficult because we we really don't know. We really don't know what we're going to do or how we're going to Anything can happen, bro. Anything can happen. That's one thing that is for sure. Expect the unexpected. Can we all agree on that? Expect the unexpected because it's like, it's pretty wild. It's pretty wild. And I don't know what's up with this thing. It's acting up. It's crazy. But yeah, that game was fun. But I really want to go, like I said, I'm going to go to the uh, the Charger game. But I want to make sure that it's, you know, if it's a night game, I, damn, dude, just, I don't know. We'll figure it out, bro. You know what I'm saying? Just, it will be all right. How we all feeling, you guys? Let's go, man. Like, come on, man. Let's go. I'm so excited about this season. I'm so excited. Let's go. J. George says, I got the best video in Miami when their fans were screaming. Hold on. Where did that shit go? Oh, he, he took it off. I don't, I don't know what the fuck happened. He's a dig as a past his prime. <laughs> Uh, 9v9 says, I wore an Earl Campbell jersey to a Raiders game, or Raiders versus Ram game, and got cons uh, constant shit. Go figure. Uh, beer is a wonderful thing. Lux says, uh, man, my team is terrible this season. I hope we have a better season. Who's your team, Lux? Who's your team? Billy Scott said, fool, you better go if it's a night game. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, Liam says, I got a question. What's better, Colts or a bag of chips? It's hard, I know. Bro, bro, hold on, hold on. Bro, I don't eat chips much, but check. Have you have y'all ever seen these? Have y'all ever seen flaming hot pretzels? Like for real, I'm I'm I, I I was like what? Check this out, fuck man, these are like it's <laughs> a lot of dust. What the fuck? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I was at Target a few days ago. I think I was at Target, and I was like, what the fuck is that? Bro, 
If you ain't had them, if you ain't had them, bro, they fire. Not really spicy, but uh, they, they're good, man. Real good. He said, I'm going to try to figure this profile shit out soon. JR, come on, bro. <laughs> he said, Eagles, my man. Oh, okay. Okay, Lux. That's what's up. What's up, Nico? Uh, he says, they look like, they look fire, look wise and taste wise. <laughs> he said, those are fire tea. I've had them once. He said, they good. Don't hate on them. They're, they're fire, bro. They're pretty good. Like, Cheetos, yeah, I don't do that Cheeto mac and cheese shit. I think I've tried it before, but I don't really do that. He said, those look gas. They're good, bro. He says, they ain't too dry. I mean, I, I, I mean, I think anytime you're eating like a pretzel, which is typically dry and you got Cheeto dust on it, you might want to have a, a glass of water next to you. <laughs> uh, Titan fan says, I'm trying to get the membership and it's not letting me. It's pinned at the top of the, uh, at, at the top of the chat, bro. Hit that link. Yes, sir. Shout out to all the new members again, man. We got uh, reoccurring members coming back. Uh, yeah, it's been crazy, bro. The Amazing Cajun says, TA Snack Channel, let's go. A little game day eats? A little game day eats? Nah, I don't. Uh, yo, those Zappo Voodoo pretzels are bomb as hell. What's a Zappo Voodoo pretzel? What the fuck? Is that this? No, this is not it, bro. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, that's weird. I'm not sure about the the membership thing. Let me see if I can repost post it here. Here, yeah, you guys can try that. Maybe that'll work. He says snack channel. Uh, Nodwin says, "Ta, uh, do you like the fried pickles? Ta, they're fire." Bro, I don't. What is that? A f like like a chip or like a real fried pickle? Like I don't know what that. I'm not. I don't think I tried that, my guy. Yeah. <laughs> the fuck is a fried? He said, "What the fuck is a fried pickle, bro?" <laughs> Come on, bro. Uh, I'm gonna try one more of these. I don't know. See, look at that. What do y'all think? That's a lot of Cheeto dust on that bad boy, huh? You see that? Bro, he said, he said, have you tried a fried pickle? Like, like, like a pickle deep fry? Like, I'm confused. All right. He said fried pickles are pickles that have been deep fried. They are heat, bro. Don't sleep. So, is it beer battered? Is it, uh, is it uh, panko battered? <laughs> like, what, what, what's going on here? Do you just... Take the pickle and put it in in, in in some hot oil. Like, what's going on here, bro? You gotta you got you gotta explain that one to me. That's crazy. Pickle slices. Hmm. What up, Titans fan? How y'all doing, bro? Damn, y'all are fried pickle eaters. Y'all want to know what I do? You can get a pickle if you want, but I prefer cucumber. You get a cucumber, and then you chop it into little slices, right? Or you can. You can dice it, slice it, whatever the fuck you want to do. I just typically... Uh, you get a, a half a lemon, uh, you, and um, you pour the lemon or lime, or both, whatever. And then you get tapatio. Um, you get tapatio or the... Uh, um, anything that's like tapatio base. There's other ones that are similar to that type, but tapatio is preferable. Preferably the one you need to use. And then you also take... Um, tahin and you add tahin to it as well and you mix it all together and then and then you just put a, a toothpick in each piece and 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 have it soaking in that juice and then when you're done eating it you drink the juice after it's crazy bro change your life maybe i'll maybe i'll start I'll, maybe i'll start doing some more game day eats and drinks for you guys we got so many different like margarita styles shots different uh crazy mixture drinks like we got a lot of different things that, that that we could we could bring to the table and and i think you guys would really enjoy that he said it's a southern thing ta i guess so bro that's crazy the gaming chef says stefan Diggs is a locker room cancer definitely not someone i would have paired up with my young quarterback 
He wasn't, uh, he wasn't satisfied being most targeted. How will he act when he isn't? Oh, preach it, bro. Jonathan says, yeah, it's a Southern thing. Their fire, though. Hey, man, if y'all want to know about tacos, you know, I'm the right guy to talk to. You know what I'm saying? Oh, man, I know tacos for day. Uh, yeah, buddy. Hey, you guys, we're like 12 subscribers away from 14,500. I know we're going to get it. We still have like 40 minute, 45 minutes to go. So I want to thank you guys right now because I know we're going to get it. So, again, that's crazy, bro. That's crazy. We're, we're, we're doing two hours every single night, putting out other content as well. The, like, it's crazy how fast we're growing, man. Really, I really do appreciate everybody who continues to hit like, comment, subscribe, and continue to join the membership. Don't forget about the Discord. We got like a hundred and what? How many people in the Discord? It's crazy, bro. Um, Nod Win says, I forgot I'm from Kentucky, so maybe they ain't popular in Cali. I only know of like fried pickles and stuff from like uh like carnivals and stuff or like like the, like the Del Mar Fair or something like that. <laughs> Liam says, "Bro, I don't know why I'm thinking of fucking uh taking talkie dust on my control." I have no idea what you're talking about, Liam. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I'm confused, bro. <laughs> Uh, Ariel Carter says, sub T, I've been confused lately. Should Titans get alt, build that wall around Levis, or get jiggy with neighbors if they both are there? I think if they're both there, I think Titans will take a, a real chance at neighbors, knowing that he's got that speed, um, and, and that, that burst ability. Um, but man, it's hard to pass on somebody that's damn near 6'10 in a helmet. <laughs> that moves like he moves, man. I'm telling you, bro. Uh, we're sitting good. I, let's just be happy where we are. We're sitting good. Um, it, it's, it's a good opportunity. It's a good opportunity. Uh, TA, would you love spicy fried pickle slices? I would try it, bro. I just don't understand it. You know what I'm saying? I, I it's nothing that's around here that, that I, that I'm familiar with. You know what I'm saying? That's crazy. He said, how do you join the discord? Uh, the the Discord is uh is pinned by the mods. They've been po posting it throughout the whole time. Yes, sir. <laughs> that's crazy. The Discord's right there. That that's not working either. That's crazy. It's weird that none of the things are working for you, Titans fan. I don't know. Maybe uh, maybe you're blocked or something from like being able to do that. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Yeah, buddy. I love it, man. I love. I'm excited about this. Like this team is is ready to take that next step. This team is ready to take that next step and win some games. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You guys ready for Willie Mayo? Will Levis! Will Levis to Calvin Ridley. Will Levis to DeAndre Hopkins. Will Levis to Traylon Burks. Will Levis to Chick, 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 Chiggy, Chiggy, Chiggy. Can't you see? Sometimes your hands be dropping too many passes. It pisses T.A. off so he yells so loud. Catch the fucking balls in 2024. <laughs> oh, please, Chig. Please, Chig. Catch some fucking balls. Don't drop as many as you did last year. Please. Um, and then, again, Tony Pollard and, and Ty J. Spears will hold down... Uh, you know, the back end for what we need to hold down. Pause. So I'm excited about it. I'm excited about it. The draft is coming up very soon, fellas. The draft is coming up very, very soon. It's creeping up on us one day at a time. Those days are adding up fast. And uh, before we know it, the Titans are going to be up there at number seven. The Titans are going to sit there and have an option. Take whoever's available, best available, arguably, or you trade back. We've talked about every scenario. We've talked about everything that could possibly go down. What's the best way to make this offense undeniably unstoppable going into this next season? What do you do at sitting there at number seven? What do you do sitting there at seven to make your offense that much better? Joe Alt is probably going to be there. Do you even just mess around like or anything? Do you even... like? What if, what if he's not good? And then you wasted the opportunity of not having the extra pick from trading back or having that explosion on offense in Malik Neighbors if he's there. These are the things that are running through my head all the time that I always try to run by you guys because it's crazy, bro. It's crazy. 
Levis is the GOAT, bro. He's going to change everything, man. Kaysen says, I'm ready for Willie Rockets to launch some balls. Pause. Uh, Gunner says, hey, I'm a big fan of the Chiefs, but how do you feel about Sneed, even, even, though, I'm a, even though I'm a big uh, fan of the Chiefs and we lost him? Dude, I'm excited. Everybody, every, hey, all my Titans fans in the chat, how do you feel about Legereus Sneed coming over from the from the uh, from them Chiefs, from them from them ketchups and mustards over there? You know what I'm saying? How are we all feeling about having Legereus Sneed as our number one A? Or you know, respectfully to uh, to Cheeto, I think everybody over here is happy about it, bro. Like we needed it. We needed to have some stability. We had respectfully Sean Murphy Bunting and and not respectfully shitty ass Christian Fulton. Like, come on, bro. We needed to improve. Facts. We just needed to improve. Joey Shanks, what's up, bro? He says, Will Levis is going to be tested. Usually quarterbacks in their second year tells the tale. That's a fact. Usually no one has the blueprint for these quarterbacks. It's a fact, bro. And, 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 but we did what I, I think. I would love to know what you're, you're not a Titans fan. So from looking from the outside in, did the Titans, I, I mean, I think the Titans have done really well. You go and, I mean, what's a good way to help your offense who may not be ready to go right away? You get you improve your defense to where you can get your offense more opportunities to get some more points. Legereus Sneed and Cheeto, Chidobia Wuzier as your corners? Like, that's crazy. That's insane. That's arguably the best set of corners in football, arguably on paper. They got to go out and still do it. You know what I'm saying? Chemistry may be a thing we'll see. But I would love to know what you think, bro. Like, seriously, um... You know, I think we did a really good job bringing in guys. Like, D-Hop is there, locked into his role. Uh, we went out and got the Broncos center, who is going to be our next Ben Jones and hold it down. Um, you know, Calvin Ridley coming over, the Jaguars' best player. <laughs> I mean, the Titans have done a lot of good things so far, so I'm happy about it, bro. I really am. Oh, man, I love it. Okay, where is that? Uh... Uh, Titan South says, T, I feel the same way. Uh, like, should we trade back if we get a good offer regardless on who's on the board? I just think that if Malik Neighbors or Marvin Harrison Jr. is on the board, I wouldn't even trade back. If Joe Alt's on the board, do we trade back if the offer's, like, legit? Or do you just, like, nah, we can't pass on him. Let's give Will Levis that big wall to throw behind and, and our our kind of shorter running backs, you know, people to hide behind. Like, it's interesting. It really is. It's hard, bro. It's fucking hard, man. Uh... Titanus says, we love Sneed. Nyad Wynn said, Sneed is a dog. Michael M. Sneed, fire. Uh, Earth Citizen 3, party Sneed. Captain Hoodie says, Sneed, he's going to get burnt constantly. <laughs> oh, Titanium Chris says, TA, how crazy would it be if we trade up and go quarterback? That does, It just doesn't make any sense. Uh, Ariel Carter says, I see the, the media meat writing Texans, but forgot Titans thrive at being underdogs. Preach it, Carter. Cat Nelson says, Sneed. Kaysen Ledbetter says, Sneed is locked down. Daniel Murdoff says, uh, he's a Ravens fan, says King Henry to Ravens is going to give us a Super Bowl. It's a possibility. Raymond says, what up, TA? Got here late, but I hear the rest of the Texans got scared when uh, when we got Calvin and Sneed. <laughs> hey, they, they just need to know that we're here. We're, 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 here to, we're here to compete. We're here to fight. We're here to battle for the crown. We're not going nowhere. I love it, bro. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Oh, my God. I'm so excited. He says he looks better. Yeah, bro. He's better than what you had. <laughs> I think that's pretty pretty obvious, right, Joey? He's better than what we had, bro. It's fucking crazy what we had. We didn't have shit. We didn't have nothing, bro. Like, it was so bad, especially how injured we were. And, ah, man, it was rough. He says on paper is key. I, I, again, it, I mean, until they play, that's all we can say is on paper because that's all it is on paper. We just got them. They haven't played yet together, so we got to, you know what I mean? Oh man, uh, not nah, Adwin says pre-draft. I give our off uh, off season an A minus right now. I don't think you can go anything under an A. Even a B plus to me is disrespectful. I don't care what anyone says. Uh, Titan Saucy says I think we need to trade back, and we got we got so many holes. Pause. <laughs> oh man, y'all, I, I y'all are awesome, bro. I swear to God, y'all are awesome. Uh, Gunner says I think y'all are gonna win this Super Bowl this year, but I, re huh? But I respect the Titans. Good luck. Okay, um, thanks, Gunner. All right. Michael says, TA, tell all the people about the logos for the channel memberships. They're small, so they can't really see what they are 100%. Oh, yeah, don't worry. Uh, Ed, we'll worry about that later, bro. Don't worry about that. They're, we're still upgrading shit, man, so it's not that big of a deal right now. 
Titan South, that two dollar dono, kind of a kind of big on trading back and getting a Marius Mims and a Marius Mims, a big boy that could play well. Again, I just think that if if, if we're not a hundred percent sold on who's available, just trade back, bro, and get more picks. The bet that's the best thing to do. Uh, Jr. says Mims is a monster. I'd rather get neighbors and another tackle. Hey, Jr. got a picture, bro. Let's go. He says, can you send through the Discord? Yeah, we'll send it through the Discord. We'll be able to get you guys membered up. Go to the Discord. Hit the Discord. Everybody join, man. Join the Discord. I haven't checked. Uh, again, we, we do have Cash App again for all the people who want to do that. Cash App, money sign, Titan Anderson. We are, we are within 10. 10 subscribers from 14,500. Let's go, guys. Oh, my God. That's crazy. That's nuts. That's crazy. I appreciate you guys, man. Seriously, man. Uh, these uh, these live streams, it, it just seems like every single time now, we're always over 100, even reaching up to 200 and over 200 at times. Um, and we're live every single day, you guys. We're going to start putting out more and more videos for you guys for more entertainment. So uh, the more you guys hit like, the more you subscribe, the more you continue to show up and add to this watch time, you guys should see our watch time looks like this. It looks like the Eiffel Tower. It's fucking crazy, bro. It's crazy. So I just I just think about it and look at these look at these rooms we're in. We're never in rooms like we always are oh yeah, it'll be over under 100 sometimes, but it's always over 100, well into sometimes into the 200s. It's crazy. So imagine, we're not stopping. We're doing this all the way up until week 1. We want live rooms. We ain't going nowhere. We're building a fucking family around here. A football family, y'all. Double F. You don't have to be a Titans fan to be subscribed and enjoy content. That's crazy to me. All right, let's go. What do we got? What do we got? Yeah, but yeah, we can send it through the Discord, bro. J. George says, from left to right. Who wants to? Okay, yeah, well, I see what you're saying. I don't want to do all that right now. I appreciate you guys. He's like, I can't find it anywhere else. That's crazy. Uh, Gunner says, I like the Ravens and Titans. Good luck on the Super Bowl. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. He's, JS75 says, you ever try fry Oreo? How does that work? How do you fry an Oreo? How do you fry an Oreo? You just drop it in there. I've heard, and again, they have that at the uh, at the, uh, the Del Mar Fair or the San Diego County Fair. I think they call it now, which is crazy. But I've never, I've never tried one. Never tried one. I always get the stuff like the... Um, What's that shit called? Uh, um, like, like I, I like the like uh, pizza on a stick is fire, bro. They always have, and they have the, you know, the nachos are like piled up like a fucking old lady in the fifties hairstyle, or like Marge Simpson's hair, and they got the cheese and the chili and all that, and the funnel cakes. Like that's the type of shit that I go for. You know what I'm saying? But I'm not really like I don't really eat eat too much like that. So, uh, but yeah, anytime I see pizza or anything like that, I, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm on that. Appreciate you, bro. Yeah, I see you, Will. I see if you're still watching, man. I appreciate you, man. Appreciate you. Oh, man. Uh, cool kid says Texans got Stefan size. Don't worry about that. We got, we got, we got the Stefan Diggs counter. We've got the guy who shuts him down, locks him down like a mental patient. No, straight jacket. You ain't going nowhere, Stefan Diggs. Locked down. Legereus Sneed doesn't allow him to do anything. And he knows that. He knows that. Uh, Joey, 70, uh, Joey Shakes says, From an Eagles fan, we had everything on paper. All it takes is bad coaching. Any team can get rid of players and spend money on anyone. It's, pr it's producing draft picks and coaching. It, it's, um, it, it's everything. I think, I, think, um, I think what you're saying is true, but it's more than that. It's... It's chem team chemistry is huge. Having the right guys in those leader roles are huge. Like you look at a lot of those Super Bowl teams, they have the right leadership in the right places. Like um, it, it really matters. And I think that the Titans, like like again, you you want to have a quarterback that is either a really good game manager that can make all the throws still uh, and, and not turn the ball over and have a good defense, or you got to have that quarterback. You know what I'm saying? You got to have that that defensive enforcer. You got to have your right with the good coaching. If you don't have a good coaching, you ain't going fucking nowhere. You got to be able to protect the ball. You've got to be able to call the right plays. You got to be able to stay healthy. Health may be the number one most important thing for every single team. If you're not healthy, you are not winning a Super Bowl. And again, not everyone's healthy. 
when I say healthy, I mean relatively healthy because everybody's hurt towards the end of the season. Everybody's got some, some, some bumps and bruises and cuts and whatever. But I'm talking about those teams like the Titans have been banged up, breaking NFL records with most people suited up back-to-back years. It's crazy, bro. Like, let that sink in. Crazy, man. I appreciate it, man. I appreciate it, you guys. We still got 30 more minutes to go, man. Let's get it. Kaysen says, I'm going to be so happy when we win a Super Bowl. Man, I would... Uh, man, I'd probably, I'd probably cry. I'm going to be honest. I'd probably cry. I'm going to keep it 100. I'd probably cry. But it'd be the most... The most heroic cry y'all ever seen. <laughs> like, <laughs> we did it. Woo! You know what I'm saying? I'd be happy as hell, bro. I know you guys would be too, man. We're going on this ride together, man. So when we do win a Super Bowl, uh, hopefully we do, it's going to mean a lot, man. It's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. A lot of people mentioning Newman as well. That's interesting. That's interesting. Appreciate you, Titanus. Uh, Link says, Titan Anderson, you can just call me TA if you want, you guys. It's a lot shorter. Uh, I think Will Levis is the guy capable of taking y'all to a Super Bowl with the right guys around him. I do, too. Everything that I've seen, the throws that he's made, everything like that, I, I, I think he can be that person. I really believe that. I really believe that. Yeah, J- Justin Fields sucks. I don't know what you're talking about. He's terrible. Like, seriously terrible. Appreciate you for joining Uh. Back with the uh, membership, Joey. I appreciate it, bro. It's back, man. It feels good to be back. You know what I'm saying? It feels real good to be back. Oh, my God. Ariel Carter says, try doubling D-Hop. You're in trouble trying... Uh, try doubling Ridley. You're in trouble. Exactly, bro. Hey, Joey, you got PS... Don't you have PS5, bro? Dude, we gotta definitely get a fucking live Madden game in, bro. Me versus Joey Shakes. You know... The top of the top Eagles content creator versus the top of the top Titans content creator. Joey Shakes, when the new Madden comes out on PS5, I challenge you to a live stream. Teach me how to do the double live thing so we both can be live. And let's go to war. Titan Anderson versus Joey Shakes. Titans versus Eagles. PS5 live. That shit will be crazy, bro. If you're down, bro, let me know, man. Let me know for real, bro. We get it cracking. That'd be dope. Yes, sir. Uh, JR says, I don't know about y'all, but when TA shuts it, uh, shuts this down, I'm ready to... Oh, my God, bro. JR, you're all over the place, bro. I don't know what you're talking about, big dog. Pause. He said, what's your gamer tag, TA? I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be honest. I don't remember. I'm going to be honest. I don't remember. I haven't played. Joey probably knows. I don't fucking know. I haven't played. This thing hasn't even been hooked up for at least a half a year. I haven't. Pl- I have a. It's funny because people can't even get PS5s. I've had it for so long and I don't even use it. Like, I don't know, bro. I just, I, I don't even know. Like, to be honest, I just don't know. But but we're going to we're gonna be heavy. We're, we're trying to get a monitor, bro, like a super curved HD one. And, and we're going to try to do some some live Madden games for y'all on PS5. Uh, I think that'll be a lot of fun, you guys. I really do. Uh, let's see. Overchicken says, you should just buy the newest Madden out and play now. It's only like 20 bucks, bro. Nah, I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait for my comeback. <sighs> <laughs> I'm just gonna wait, bro. I'm not trying to do Madden right now. I just don't really feel like it. I'm gonna I'm gonna wait and make it perfect, you guys. So it's gonna be dope. It's gonna be dope. It'll be me up here on the top, like this part of the screen, and on the bottom it'll be all Madden live stream, fellas. It'll be dope as shit. It'll be dope. Uh, Link says I'm barely learning NFL, but I might be a Titans fan. That's what I'm talking about, bro. Uh, Gamer Rage says I live about two hours from Nissan Stadium. Love going to the Titans games. Excited to see what Levis can do with the new offense. I'm not sold on him 100% just yet. We'll see what happens. Tighten up. I appreciate you, bro. I appreciate you, bro. Just just think about the throws that he made with no protection, with a terrible coach, with terrible coaches, uh, and, and limited weapons and resources and everything in between. You get what I'm saying, bro? Like, like trust me. He, he's, <laughs> he's the real deal. You'll see. He's going to dominate this year. Everybody sit back, relax, and get some flavored popcorn. <laughs> get some two-tone blue popcorn, baby. Get some blueberry and some blue raspberry or some shit because it's about to go down. I love it, bro. I love it. I'm excited, man. 
He said, Link, turn away while you still can, bro. Ah, oh, man. That's my guy, though. That's crazy. He's, he got the popcorn out. Uh, Liam says, I still remember when Will Levis carried us to the victory against the Dolphins. That were not... Uh, that were nine and three. That game was insane, bro. That live stream was crazy. That live stream was crazy. Uh, Titans fan says, "Are you excited for the new college game?" Nah, I'm not gonna play that. I'm gonna play. I'm gonna play with the Titans. I only play with the Titans. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna play with the Titans and beat everyone up on with, with the Tennessee Titans. That's what we're gonna do. That's what we're gonna do. We got we got uh, we got like 25 minutes left, you guys, on this two hour live stream. Yes, sir. I appreciate all the donations, man. All the people who have sent Cash App, Super Chat, everything in between, the likes, the comments, everyone subscribing. We're almost there. At, did we already reach it? Almost there. We are eight subscribers from 14,500, man. Help us get there so we can celebrate that shit. Let's go. Uh, Julian says, TA, what do you think about Nick Westbrook Aquino? I'm glad he's back, Kyle. I'm going to be honest. I'm glad he's back. He's He deserved it. He he deserved he deserved to come back. He he's reliable. He brings um he brings a lot to the table. He really does. He's a uh, he's um he's good on special teams. He's not the greatest receiver, but he's reliable and he understands what we're trying to do. He already has some some chemistry with with uh with Will Levis, so it's I'm I think it's okay. You know what I'm saying? I think it's okay. Shoot, I might play some UFC too. I might I might uh, TA might get some UFC going. I might, I might, I might have to go up and give someone a fucking running, running knee. You know what I'm saying? I might have to give someone a running knee. He says I actually got swiped out. What does that even mean? I don't know what that means, big dog. Oh man, yes sir. He said, "Imagine being a Panthers fan. Can you guys imagine that? That's so crazy, bro." I know the Panthers just are literally the worst of the worst. Like, they don't have any first-round pick. They don't have nothing. To, like, it's crazy. It's just crazy. We're five away, fellas. Everybody, if you haven't subscribed, man, go do it. Let's get it done, and let's celebrate this together, man. What an accomplishment. What a crazy accomplishment. Shout-out to everybody in the building. Another great show, fellas. Another great show. We still got 20 minutes to go, too. Gamer Rage says it means I hit the wrong button. I left for a second. Oh, you're good, bro. Like I said, we're live two hours every single day. Hey, who's your man, dude? Just chill, bro. Like, you're just overdoing it. Just chill, relax. If you have any questions, you know, we'll get to them, but just chill. You don't need to be you don't need to act like you're 12. If you are 12, you're probably in the wrong place. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Cyclops says Panthers have no hope. Not with that quarterback. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh shit what the hell are we doing he says titans have no hope lol <laughs> how many yards y'all think will levis gonna throw for this year how many yards you think he's gonna go for you think he'll throw for three thousand you think four thousand is a possibility you guys tell me you guys tell me how many yards how many touchdowns how many yards? How many touchdowns? How many interceptions? You think he's going to go to the Pro Bowl this year? How do you think Calvin Ridley is going to do? D-Hop. What are you guys thinking, man? It's exciting, bro. I'm excited to have this team. What a special team. What a special team. Liam says, bro, what's worse, being a Colts fan or a Panthers fan? Being a Colts fan because they, because they're at least the Panthers uniforms are, are decently cool. Like they got a cool little Panther on their helmet, a little, little fierce, you know? You know, back back in the day, they it used to mean something. It don't mean shit anymore, but uh, it's okay. You know, all all little little panther kittens grow up, and they'll probably grow up later. You know what I'm saying? But a colt, a, a horseshoe, is always a shitty ass shoe that steps in shit that horses wear. That's on their helmet, and that'll never change. You know what I'm saying? So it's again, yeah, I would, I would, yeah, fuck that, fuck that. Let's see what you guys are saying in the comments. Uh, he said, I live about two hours from Cashville. I love going to Titans games. Oh, yeah, I, I did read that, Gamer. I, I read that, man. My bad. J. George says, maybe 3,000 yards in his first game. <laughs> Lou Man says, 4,040 yards. Kason says, 3K. Titan SRT says, 3K. King Balmer says, 
Will Levis is the GOAT. You're right, King Bomber. Shane Loki says 4,000 yards and 38 touchdowns and four rushing touchdowns. That's insane. I hope you're right. Raymond says, the one thing I hate about this offseason is losing to Nico Autry. He had his career season, 12 sacks, but he was a Vrabel guy. Plus, we wasn't paying him $10 million a year. Uh, I, it's, uh, I hate talking about Danico Autry because he's such a pro, such a great player. Well-deserved contract for him. He's, he, he's amazing. He's one of the greatest players we've ever uh, gotten in, in, in an off-season, acquis- in an off-season pickup. You know, one of the best off-season acquisitions we've ever gotten. Uh, Titan Saucy 3K. Will says Bryce Young throws 4,000 next year. Hot take. That's crazy. Bryce Young ain't throwing fucking 3,000 yards. Not even close. Titans fan says 7,000 yards, 587 touchdowns, zero interceptions. I like it, bro. Alan Darby says, TA, tighten up forever, my Titans family. Yes, sir. I love it. Colt's got a crap logo, Stoner Titan said. Of course, man, of course. Will says the black helmets are fire. The black, the black, in, the black in the helmet's fire, but the logo just makes it look like a Walmart toilet seat. That's all it looks like. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. Uh, Nathan says Texans winning the division. Maybe, maybe, but I think we have a chance too. Uh, L Dandy says the only thing I want next season. Uh, are the Chiefs and the Niners to be mid? Can we have like a Texans Lions Super Bowl or something? Nah, we can't have the Texans in a Super Bowl. The Colts or the Jags either. They're never allowed in a Super Bowl, so you can choose somebody else, but not them. Titans fan. Uh, yeah, I'm not okay. I see what you're saying. Yeah, King Bomber has been amazing. Uh, he says Will Levis is gonna throw rockets out there. Do you guys see his comment? King Bomber, he's starting to turn to a Titans fan. He says, "Will Willie, oh, Will Levis is gonna throw rockets this year." Yeah, King Bomber, that's my guy right there. I, he is though. You're right. You're right though. He's gonna dominate, bro. Yeah, Jay George. He's just, he, I, I'm, he. It's funny. He's giving all these compliments now. It's pretty cool. I like it. I dig it. I dig it. Hoosier, Hoosier, Hoosier. Something wrong with you, big dog. There's something wrong with you guys. Yeah, he's going to be headed back to time. <laughs> he said, TA, you're funny as fuck. I mean, I try, bro. I try. I'm not going to do stand-up or anything like that, but I appreciate your comments, though, man. You're killing it tonight. Um, Gunner says, go Chiefs. He says, shots fired. That's, that's crazy. Ariel Carter says, Eagles, are, uh, Eagles better worry about 49ers, and that's facts. I guess we'll see. I don't really give a fuck. Uh, Titan South says, I got a feeling Hopkins will still want to stay after this year and retire a Titan. I, ho- I, I would love for that to happen, but that's why I think if Malik Neighbors is on the field, uh, or on the field, I'm done, is still available in the draft at number seven, you take him right away. So you have him and Ridley together, even if D-Hop leaves. Uh, Dre says, are you going to go to the NFL draft in Detroit? Hell no. Fuck no. I'll be live streaming it, though. King Bomber says, please. I don't know what you're talking about now, bro. Oh, King Bomber says, please, Titans need to win 10-plus games and make the playoffs. Please make it happen. Will Levis is the GOAT. I appreciate that, King Bomber. Thanks, bro. Damn, you've really changed quickly, bro. I appreciate you. Damn. Uh, let's see. Titan South says, I hope. Uh, I think D-Hop wants to stay because he likes and respects Willie Rockets. That's a fact, bro. Otherwise, he would have left. Yeah, King, Titanus is right. King Bomber's a real one, bro. He's killing it. King Bomber's saying, hey, yo, even though you guys lost Derrick Henry, Ty J Spears is the next king for you guys. Look at this guy. This guy's amazing, bro. King Bomber, I appreciate you. Thanks, King Bomber. Thanks, buddy. Damn, bro. What got into, what, what, what got into you today? <laughs> Wild. I love it. I love it. The damn cheese. What are you cheese fans even doing, bro? Y'all cheese fans are wild, man. Holy hell. Liam says, bro, I'm stuffing my face with tacos right now. I'm starving. But don't you have COVID? Do you still have your, uh, don't you, you still have your taste and everything like that? You didn't lose any of it or not, like, maybe some of it or let me know, bro. Yeah, man. Tacos, bro. Tacos is one of the best foods in the world. Uh, Alan Darby says, T.A., did you see the Will Will, uh, Will Levis workout this offseason that he posted on Instagram? A, hey, all you haters are... Bro, 
I did see it. Did you see that quick ass sidearm throw? That snap? It looked like a fucking like a lightning bolt went off. Like what the hell just happened? It's crazy. He's legit, bro. He is legit. That is my quarterback. That is my quarterback. Willie Rocket himself. Goated. He's going to shock a lot of people this year, bro. He's going to shock a lot of people. Hey, we got like 11 or 12 minutes to go. And we're almost there at 14,500, you guys. Let's go, man. I appreciate you guys. Killing it. Killing it like Freddy Krueger. He says, Chiefs fans are normal. Chiefs fans are, are, are confused as hell, bro. Like, I don't understand you guys. You guys think you're, you know, the greatest thing since shoestring. And you're doing good right now, but no 3 P. It's over with. It's all done with. It's all done with. He said, Texans are the new Bills. That don't even make any sense. Oh, okay. Sorry, I didn't read it correctly. King Bomber says, Texans are the new Bills. But the Texans can't touch the Tennessee Titans because the Titans are the greatest team in football. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about, King Bomber. Finally, man. Finally, you're starting to show some support, bro. All that haterade in your fucking veins, bro, is an ugly look. That's what I'm saying, man. Now you're finally... You're finally... Sh I, 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 knew, I knew there was a little bit... I knew there was something about you that... that I, I knew it, bro. I knew it. And, now, and now, now you're showing your true colors. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Yeah, the Bills are in trouble, bro. The Bills are in a lot of trouble. A lot of trouble. Oh, man. Yeah, stop the spamming, fellas. Stop the spamming. We still got 10 minutes to go, y'all. 10 minutes to go. Get your final questions in. Get your final donos in. We have Cash App, Super Chab, everything like that. Man, let's go. It's been a crazy show, man. Almost two hours have gone by. That's fast, man. It's crazy how fast it goes. It's just so crazy how fast it goes. Oh, man. Jo Joshua says, most Chiefs fans have been diehard for the past four years, LOL. <laughs> oh, man, it's true, though. It's true. Yeah, King Bomber's awesome. He says, I can't wait for the season to start, TA. You're right, Titans are ready to win the world. No, it's, it's a World Series, bro. What are you talking about? Wrong sport. We're ready to win. And host the Lombardi as Super Bowl champions. Tennessee Titans, baby, stand up. Come on, y'all. Spam Titans, y'all. Titans fans. Come on. Let everybody know what kind of let everybody know where they at. Come on, bro. Light that chat. Let light that chat up in two-tone blue. Let's get it popping. Let's get it popping. Let everybody know what's up. Let's get it, man. King Bomber says, I'm definitely an Eagles fan, but my second favorite team now is the Tennessee Titans because you guys have convinced me that your team is better than mine and has better uniforms, better colors, better players, a better quarterback, better playmakers, and better management, and better leadership at the front helm. Damn, you didn't have to say all that, King Bomber. Damn, bro. I don't think your Eagles fans and, 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 and compadres and, and whatever else is not going to like that too much, bro. But again, I appreciate you. I appreciate you. EC3, I see you, bro. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, sir. Hey, just block Hoosierman for the rest. Put him on timeout for the rest of the show. He's just an he's just being being weird. <laughs> everybody hit that like button, comment, subscribe, man. I appreciate you guys, man. Everybody, uh, everybody who sent it to Cash App, everybody who donated to uh, Super Chat, everybody, man. We still got. Uh, a little less than 10 minutes to go before we got to get out of here. Crazy, bro. Appreciate you guys, man. Appreciate you guys. We're about to hit 14,500 subscribers. Fourteen five, man. That's crazy. It, it's, it's wild, man. It's been a wild journey. And again, our watch time and everything is just so high. Uh, everything is, 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 is really really doing well so I'm, I'm, I'm just i'm happy with everything i really am there we go let's get it man appreciate you guys uh will says as a panther fan i feel like we're making the playoffs and i hate it no nah, you're not making the playoffs bro I, I hate to be i hate to tell you i hate to tell you that you're not what's good texans for life we good over here bro we good over here
Yeah, we good, bro. King Bomber says, um, my first favorite team in the NFL is starting to become uh, the Tennessee Titans just because blue is better than green and your quarterback is better than ours. I don't blame you, bro. Like I said, you're, you could, you're always allowed here, bro. Uh, Palmer says, uh, I love your room. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for all the donations and stuff too, you guys. Let's go. Joshua Reyes, $2 dono. Appreciate you, bro. Let's go. 14500 man. 14500 And we're just getting started. Like I said, man, this has all just been from live streams. We haven't been putting out no videos or shorts or anything just because we've been waiting for the memberships to come in. It's back. <laughs> oh, man, I can't wait. It's been fun, man. It's been fun. We got a little over five minutes to go before we hit that two-hour mark. So, again, man, get your final questions in here. I appreciate everybody so much for their support. It's crazy. It's crazy how fucking far this channel has come in so little time. Literally, like, I've been around for so long, but we... I mean, you look at this channel's growth from last year to even just to this year alone, it's crazy, man. It's crazy. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. We need four more, fellas. We need four more. King Bomber says, I'm going to be back tomorrow night to celebrate with you guys. Tighten up, Code Blue, Cyclops Swag. Good night, bro. Hey, I appreciate you, King Bomber. You keep practicing your two-tone blue. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate you. Venom Boy says, Bengals are beating the Titans next year. You know that's not happening. You need to stop it. Uh, Gunner says, I love your Titans clothes. Thanks, bro. Appreciate it. Tighten up, King Bomber. <laughs> it's crazy. Appreciate, again, all, all the donations, man. Seriously, I, I, I really do appreciate it. It means a lot to me, you guys. It means a lot to me. Oh, my God, man. This is crazy, bro. Wow, man. We've had over 100 the whole time, man. All the way up to damn near 200. Uh, a lot of fun, man. A lot of fun. And this is why we do what we do, bro. This is why we do what we do. I love it. I really do. I'm, I'm excited about, um, you know, everything coming for this year. I really am. I think that our offense is is good enough to compete with anybody in the NFL. I really, really believe that. And I think our defense is going to shock so many people. And when we start racking up wins and, and they're starting to look at all these teams down, you know, halfway through the season and the Titans are one of the teams still standing out, uh, they're going to be like, wait a minute, maybe we misjudged them. Yeah, no shit. You always do. Everybody does. Everybody does. It's fucking ridiculous. Oh, man. This is crazy. This is crazy. <laughs> Oh, uh, man. He said, go for another hour. Lady T.A. will sign off on it. That's hilarious. Uh, let's see. Ariel Carter says, T.A. is turning Eagles to the Titans. We're just trying to give the, the those guys a better place to, you know what I'm saying, to relax. Uh, shout out to my guy, Joey, though. That's <laughs> Joey Shakes, man. If, if you if you want to, I mean, even if you don't like the Eagles, I recommend subscribing. He's he's great. He really is. Uh, will says, Bryce Young's going to cook next season. Look at his. Nah, I'm done reading. Bryce Young sucks. Bryce Young sucks. Uh, Stoner Titan says, I see Ryan Tannehill is a in a Cowboys uniform. Uh, in a uni Cowboys uniform. That could It could happen, maybe. I don't know. I haven't been paying attention to Ryan Tannehill. I wish him all the best. You know, thank him. I thank him for what he brought to the table. But he fucked up so much, man. We gave a... We put him in position to win a Super Bowl, at least to get there, man. And he fucked it up so many so many times, bro. Like, yeah, he was good in the regular season, but fuck, so, many, so was a lot of other guys. So was Matt Ryan. What the fuck did he ever do? Oh, we got to a Super Bowl. Yeah, and what is he known for? Blowing the biggest comeback of all time. That's what he's known for. It's crazy, bro. Some people are just some people are just meant for regular season or just better in the regular season. Some people ain't got that him gene in him. You know what I'm saying? They just don't. Well, Will Levis got that shit, bro. Will Levis is him. He's gonna bring us, he's gonna bring the Titans a Super Bowl. He's gonna bring Titans a Super Bowl. Whether you like it or not, it's gonna happen. Whether you like it or not, it's going to happen. We only need two more subscribers, you guys. Everybody, two more subscribers, and we have two minutes to do it. Let's go, fellas. Let's go. 14.5 is within reach. Uh, Titan Saucy says, TA got Thanos gauntlet changing people to Titans fans. I'm just trying to build a family over here, bro. Like, seriously, I just want everybody, I just want everybody to have a place to go where they could be, be, you know, be heard. A lot of people will go to these live streams and talk and want their voices heard and nobody will even talk to them so it's like you know it, it's getting harder be, it's getting harder because of the uh 
it's getting harder because of how, how big the rooms are getting. But uh, yeah, man, that's what Super Chat and all those things are for so we can guarantee and get you guys your, your comments read off for sure. And then also channel members, they get priority in chat always. So yeah, that's how it is, bro. That's how it is. Make sure you guys check out that that newest short, uh, the newest short that I made. It's really good, man. We got a lot more coming out. Um, like I said, we're still learning how to use this new phone. We have that new iPhone 15 Max Pro, ti blue titanium, and it's 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 amazing, man. But it's I'm an Android guy, so I, I don't know how to use it that well yet. So I'm still learning, bro. When you when you do so much on your other phone, Android and Galaxy, for years on your on your channel, it's so difficult, bro. It really is. It really it gets difficult, but but we getting it, man. We've we've learned a lot, man. We learned a lot. Shout out to Titan Punk. Welcome to the TA Army. We're gonna change that name once we get off of here, bro. Like that's what we're gonna do. But I appreciate it, man. We got fifty nine likes. Appreciate all the donations, everybody. It's so cool knowing that Super Chat is back. I love it, man. We only need one more subscriber. Let's get it, man. Hit that subscribe button. Let's get it. Fourteen thousand five hundred. He says, "Welcome to Apple Gang." It's crazy. I went from Android to Apple last year and never go back. I'm not going to go back. I'm not going to, trust me, because I got a MacBook Pro and it's easier for me. You know, everything's like linked and shit. But yeah, it's it's way different. The hashtags are in a different spot. The exclamation point. Uh, even the way you back things out and move things around it, everything's different, bro. So it's just got to be muscle memory again. You know what I mean? Or I'll have little TA teach me. He's a beast on iPhones and stuff. Shout out to little TA. He don't let nothing slow his ass down. He said, why did you time me out? Because you act like a fucking weirdo, bro. You need to cu cut it out. Cut that shit out. Well, you guys, we hit the two-hour mark. Thank you guys so much, man. Thank you guys so much. The two-hour mark has been received. Like, comment, get your final subscriptions in. Get them going. Uh, shout out to you again, Titans Punk, for becoming a channel member. So that's pretty cool. Thank you for that. Um, amazing show, fellas. Amazing show. Uh, we're going to be back tomorrow. We're going to have a lot of videos coming out tomorrow before the live stream. So make sure you guys tune in for that. Make sure you guys join the Discord. Go check out all the videos that I've been putting out. Go leave a like on them. Go comment on all of them. And um, support the channel, man. Again, we have Cash App for all the people who, who want to donate and, and can't through Super Chat for whatever reason. Cash App, money sign, Titan Anderson. I want to thank you guys so much. Thank you guys for making us get 14500 I love y'all so much, man. I appreciate you guys so much. I'm Titan Anderson. You can't spell Titans without putting that T-A in it. I love you guys, man. Let's go.